Ken Easley of the Seattle Seahawks, and you're watching Norb Camp. What's up, 12s? It's Love the Tuba with the Seattle Seahawks, and you're watching Norb Camp. I'm DK Metcalf from the Seattle Seahawks, and you're watching Norb Camp. Let's get us in focus here. There we go. Yep. What's up, everybody? This is Norbcam and the return of my dad, Kuya Burt, yes. to the studio. But of course, tonight, Norb, we we're are wearing, not rooting for the uh, Seahawks. Well, we're always rooting for the Seahawks, but we're watching. We're watching the Huskies. The UW Huskies, yes, in the Apple Cup, coming up in just a minute. But... Uh, Oh, it looks like they ruled against it. We were just watching the end of this uh, Texas A&M LSU oh, game. LSU right. is about to be upset by Texas A&M. A lot of a lot of upsets today. Oregon losing to Oregon State. Wow, uh, that one was not seen coming. So actually, now Oregon is really rooting for Wazoo because That's if the right. Seahawks or sorry, if the Huskies lose, they the. Oregon still has a chance of making it to the Pac-12 championship, championship game. Oh. But if they win, then there's a three-way tie, and then Utah ends oh up going God. instead of Oregon. At least that's my understanding. So it's yeah. kind of a crazy, yeah, that's crazy uh, time in college football. But well, tonight, I want to say this game. thank you to Orr for inviting me tonight because i never seen a Husky game <laughs> <laughs> live or otherwise, you know. Uh, I'm looking forward to this uh, session. Yeah, and actually, and I yeah. hope that the Huskies win. Yeah, they've had a great season this year so far. They're uh, what nine and two as well. Wow. The uh, Cougars are uh, seven and four, but playing pretty good football as well. Mm-hmm. So I think right now it's a pretty even game. It's what so is it? Washington is only favored by two and a half points. So it's a pretty much a almost even game, given the whole. Well, I guess maybe slight advantage because the home team, which is the Cougars, they have a, they usually get a three-point automatic favor for being the home team. So the fact that Washington is also two and a half points, I guess it's a little bit more swung to the yeah. UW side. But so you have Utah, <clears throat> you have Oregon and Washington, mm-hmm. kind of all trying to do a berth in the uh, championship. Huh? Yeah, I, I, I don't yeah. think I don't think we would get it. It sounds like Utah's would win the tiebreaker, so we don't really have a... I don't think we've really got a chance in this <laughs> to get mm-hmm. to the championship game, but I don't know. We'll see how it all plays out. Well, Washington's got to win first, right? Yeah. Then we'll see what happens. Is uh, Utah ahead of Washington? No. I uh, think so. Actually... I think we would tie them if we won, hmm. and then they would have the tiebreaker. I don't know. I'm not exactly sure all the scenarios, okay. but either way, it's uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be a fun game nonetheless because the Apple Cup is always about even if whether it's a playoff game or anything involved in it, it's just the the pride of beating your yep. across the state rival. I mean, that's what it's all about, right? That's so, right. Apple Cup. We got a lot of friends watching. I'm uh, pulling Ooh, up the screen here. Push. This is my, uh, as you're watching, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd love it if you did. This is my current subscriber Ooh, count. You reached 50,000. Oh, I hit it, uh, yeah, a little while ago, and the light's you know, up here. I, with, you know, well, in Germany, I gave out uh, the, the, your calling card. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gave it to many people. I said, you, were, you know, even the guy that we met from Canada over there. Yep. I said, if you haven't watched Norgram, here, watch it. So <laughs> My dad's and, always... And the one from Icelander, uh, Iceland, and Islander, I gave him a card too. I said, okay. Uh, you know, we sometimes we do get viewers yeah. from countries as remote as Iceland uh-huh. and Europe and things like that, so why not? Bobby Cox with the Super Chat says, Hello, Norb and Dad. I think the Seahawks will win tomorrow unless they play bad. Raiders disappointing this year. My Saints are 4-6 and six at least. Hey, I think we're rooting for the Saints. I think the Saints, don't they play the Niners this week? So I think we're all Saints fans. Oh, yeah. look, we got the secret hand bringing in a special cup of coffee. You got perfect Ooh, timing. Thank, thank you. you. Wow. Oh, this okay. Is- oh, this is mine? No, this is Lola. Oh, this is this is yours. This oh, is my thank you. Yours. Okay. 
All right. <laughs> Thank you, Jim. A special magic cup of coffee and a yeah. chilly winter, well, almost winter night. Yeah. This is just like receiving a super chat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's cold outside. It is. It is pretty breezy out and there. And windy. Yeah. Very windy. Mm. Mm. So, we we'll welcome you to the show. If you guys are new to the channel. Welcome. This is uh, normally a Seahawks channel, but tonight, <laughs> sporting the UW colors in this uh, always exciting match between uh, UW and Wazoo. Last year, Wazoo beat us pretty badly uh, in the Apple Cup in uh, Husky Stadium, we got killed. So we yeah, need a little yeah, payback like this year. We were at Lloyd Ambion's home, and uh, we were expecting, uh, a lot of us were expecting that, We'd watch as usual, game. during Thanksgiving dinner, you will be watching the Apple Cup. Mm -hmm. And our, uh, our cousin, uh, Ruel Beltran, was wearing his WSU <laughs> shirt. And he was disappointed when he found out that it was not going to be that, uh, you know, that evening that they're going to play. I know, it's, it's kind of a tradition to watch it on the, we always do that ap after Thanksgiving party at their house. Yeah. And this time, you know, it's because it's tonight, the game is a Saturday instead of Friday night game. So it's about to start. The LSU game just ended. The, the yeah. Texas A&M just upset LSU 38-23. Oh, the well, crowd storms crazy. the field. <laughs> and... Uh, there you go. So, we'll see what happens in the in the game. Well, actually, it's not time to storm the field. The game's not officially over, but mm -hmm. we hope you guys all had a good Thanksgiving. We had a, a, a small one on Thanksgiving, just my parents over here at our house, and then kind of the big party last night, yep. as you said, at our that was good. My aunt's house and had you know, second uh, day of seeing food. Everybody, yeah. all right. The uh, Romano family, basically, mm -hmm. you know, especially uh, after this is the first in-person meeting after a while yep. since that COVID pandemic. Yeah, so it was a good one. Yeah. Yep. So yeah, it's always good to see the the, the family when these get-togethers since we don't do it very often. Uh, he was actually. Uh, Uncle Rowell, he was actually wearing a UW jacket with a Wazoo shirt underneath because one of his daughters went to Wazoo, the other one went to UW. Oh, is that right? Alex went to UW and <laughs> Brianna went to Wazoo. It's kind of divided, of course, <laughs> yeah. So, and even uh, in, Mon in Monica's house, you know, Monica, my sister, was a UW graduate. Then mm -hmm. their son and went to, their son Brandon, Brandon went to Wazoo, and they live in Spokane, so, you know, it's, it's always kind of when you have even right in-house rivals. There, which is, which make it, uh, it makes it uh, more interesting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Alina Dahl is in the chat, of course, and it was her birthday yesterday. Ooh. So I did a little special birthday video for her. I hope you enjoyed that. Check, check it oh, out on my channel. You had, you had a special I, I did a little, little music video song for her last night. So oh, We should be able to play that yeah. again. I don't know if I could... Well, can you think you I, I don't know if I can that? play it. Well, I if I do, it triggered the copyright thing. I so want to say, have, uh, I might have to happy do it on birthday, time. Alina. <laughs> I, I miss Alina. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll definitely show it to you. Oh my gosh, there. look at the field though. I don't know how they're going to clear that. <laughs> <laughs> they're going to be out there for a while, I'm sure. Uh, and that would probably happen, well, I guess it could happen. It, it usually happens at the home stadium, obviously. That's true. There are some you know, visiting, visiting crowd here. But again, it's uh, well, at least a couple yeah, of upsets it's today. Amazing. Tomorrow should be fun. So we get to be get to watch back to back games tonight and then tomorrow in person back to Lumen Field. It's been almost a month since we uh, yep. have been to a game in person. So, and for you, the last one you went to was more than that because you guys went to the Philippines, All right? Which was the last game you watched at the stadium. Mm. Did you see the Giants game? I'm not so sure. I, I forgot everything. It's been a while. <laughs> it's been a while. So, yep. I'm looking forward to getting back to Lumen Field tomorrow. So, I hope the Seahawks will play better than what they did in Germany. I was very disappointed. Oh, yeah. And for those yeah. of you who didn't know, my sister Monica and my dad went to Germany yep. to go watch... 
the the Seahawks play and unfortunately mm-hmm. lose the game. But it was uh, it was yeah, interesting. Experience. But you know, I I don't blame uh, the Tampa Bay for winning because I think that was the time that Brady really played well. Unfortunately, and then our <coughs> team didn't play that good. You know. We could have won it, mm-hmm. uh, except we ran out of time, and that uh, fumble by mm. uh, Gino. I said, "Oh no!" We were shouting out there. There were a lot of Seahawks fans all over the stadium, and that's a beautiful stadium. You saw that, huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I, on, on the broadcast and, and numerous posts throughout the yep. week of, of different friends who were over there. Uh, but, there's a question from Alita. She wants to know, did did Kuya speak German over there. Did you get to practice any German while you were out there? A little, but you know, in the main city, uh, practically everybody speaks English. It was only when we start, uh, you know, going somewhere where, Hello. away from the main streets oh. that yes, we did a little, but it was good. Yeah, especially when we were in Vienna. Okay. In Vienna, because we stroll along the Blue Danube, and uh, there was this lady and who who was uh, feeding the uh, uh, what do you call this? Uh, not the geese, nachos, but the, uh, the swans, the swans. Hey, why don't you put that so, over there? You know, we spoke a little in uh, in German and. Mm-hmm. Wow, this is more than getting a super chat. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Gene. Yep. Wow, what is this? Oh, nachos. Nachos, a little after dinner snack. Mm. Wow, I wish uh, Alina was here. This is a good birthday celebration. <laughs> the magic hand that appears <laughs> behind the door. Yeah. Oh, oh did the game start? God. Oh, it's already going. Oh, the it's going, going already. <laughs> oh, what are oh, we the, talking about? The game Whoa. in action. Okay, hold on a second. Look at that. And, 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 I, well, because of the, the, the length of the other broadcast kind of ate into the start of this one. So I we're see. just starting. I didn't miss too much. But we are underway. That it was a like good run, it looks like. Wazoo's my, got uh, the football to start off the game. They must receive the little one-handed wow, attempt. One hit right to tried to one hand, one dropped hand? it. All right, so early first quarter, the 9-2 and two Huskies against the 7-4 and four Cougars. Second and 10, starting off the game here. So, no, are we also having restrictions about not being to, able to show the, the game? Oh, you mean I'm putting it on the air? Uh-huh. Yeah, well, you know, it's ESPN. Just sure. Yeah, it's just too just dangerous. To sure. to, I've, I've had college stuff be flagged before, too. So yeah. most boring guys. Oh, 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 it's whoa. a face mask, too. Yeah. About a 17-yard run and a face mask. Yeah. That's going to make it a 32-yard net play. Big run by Watson. Uh-oh. Wow. That's going to be in the Looks territory. Looks like the, uh, Hus- uh, the Cougars are fired up. Yeah. You know? Worst part is he face masked and he still didn't take him down. Yeah. <clears throat> this is like how. Oh, what's bad is. about. Well, it reminds me, this is reminds me of the, the Bucks Seahawks game where they just run and constantly. And <laughs> I'm sure tomorrow the Raiders are going to want to try to run hard too. So this puts it all the way to the, to the Huskies 30 yard line. Wow. First up, oh, and they get a penalty. The Cougars do with a false start. So it'll be first and fifteen okay. from the Husky thirty-five yard line. No snow. I always like it when they get snow over in Pullman on these apple cups on that yep. side. But well, it's cold. Good, but nope. Oh, under pressure, he's gonna scramble. We're looking he's all he's doing oh, is Russell wow. Wilson act. Escapes. He's gonna oh slips oh, down. Oh, oh, oh. He slipped on that artificial turf. And it's going to be a loss of two. I don't know if that counts as a sack, but he slid. He was doing all. He was going right, then left, and forward, then back. And finally, he's, his own legs did him in. No have huddle. You ever, have you ever seen the Cougars play? I haven't watched the Cougars at no? all this year. No. Uh-uh. So I don't know I don't know much about them so at all. We don't, I don't really know how. I don't know what their weapons are. Know. I don't know what the strengths and weaknesses are. They're just like watching a whole new team here. Yep. 
Well, wait till you see this quarterback for the Huskies, Michael Penix. Second down is 17. Let's see what he does. He's going to throw. And looks downfield. Are... Throws deep left side. He's got a man. Oh, oh, he was open, but he overthrew him down, streaking down the left so sideline. That's third, no. and Third and 17. Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, Andy. They have to get that. All right, third and 17. 13 12. Left in the first quarter. Early action. Three receivers left and one to the right. Single setback is Watson. Yep. It's Colin, uh, Colin protections and plays. Wastes the shotgun snap. Takes it. And he runs a draw. Nope. Fakes oh. the draw. Looking, Uh-oh. trying to skip, throws it this time complete oh, it. to the running back, but he falls on the play, so he only gets four yards, so it's going to be fourth down in about 13. Yeah. Is he in, they, they're in field goal range now, They're right? in long field goal range, because they, you know, they but they, they're at the 30, went back to the 35, and then they lost yardage on the oh, sack. Oh, I see, so that's about, or the, what, you know, so they got some something. backs. So it's going to be, yeah, 40 something. Try. No, they are going to try. Oh, yes, 50. 50 yeah. on the money. From the near side hash going left to right. That's the right hash for Wait, the Cougars to try it. to get a 3 nothing lead. Here we go. 50 yard attempt. It's a pretty long yards. kick for college. High snap. No, oh, no, oh, no, he's got it. Oh, yeah. It bounced off the crossbar. That's what I said. It was going to hit. And it went in. I it thought, it, it hit the it bottom. Hit. It, it hit the bottom part. Oh, it was the bottom part? Yeah, it hooked in and went, and it, was, and it bounced off it <laughs> and, and into and the. That's why I Janikowski. said. Janikowski. Uh, Is he related to the uh, other yeah, Janikowski in the Raiders? going to make it, I said. Watch, it's going to bounce on the thing. Doink. Ooh. And Lucky. in. Lucky wow. shot. Wow. Lucky shot. Yeah. Got it. Janikowski. I wonder if he's related to the Raiders, former Raiders and former Seahawks kicker Janikowski. Oh, really? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Gene. Look at his name. He must be related. You can have two kickers who can mm. kick 50 yards, have the same last name, and not be related, right? They're not related, really? That's mm -hmm. amazing. All right, so three nothing. Cougars draw first blood. All right, let's see. I'd love to hit fifty thousand one hundred tonight. You guys can hit that sub button. That would be a big help. All right, here we go. Kickoff from the thirty-five. He's gonna take it. Oh, he did butter to return that one. So I yeah, I, I've that. seen that. I, I didn't. I didn't realize. So when you call a fair catch, I guess you're automatically just deciding to take the ball at the um, half he yard line. The ball. I'm surprised he go. didn't try to return it. I know. There you go. Uh, let's see. If you guys, I would take into people in the Discord if you guys want to chat a bit mm -hmm. so i'm going to put the chat right here or the link to the discord right there and pin it to the top here we go they're going to throw the left-handed panix throws deep left side it's got a man oh no oh it was batted in the air it could have been picked almost intercepted in it's second and ten so polk the intended receiver on a on a on a uh, post route, little underthrown. He had to slow down for it, yeah. and that gave the the defender who was just behind him a chance to catch up and break that ball up. Well, second and so, ten. Michael Penix, he's a left-handed thrower. Is so Penix right? throws yeah. left-handed, but this guy can sling it. They look into the sideline for the play. Don't they have What's microphones in their helmet? I don't know if they do in college. They... Uh, they usually just line up, then they look, and they give them all kinds of signals. This time it's a run, right side, bounces off tacklers. Ooh, it's seven. Going. Second like effort? Seven. Yeah, he looked like he was going to be cut down for three yeah. or four. He gets seven on the play. Oh, Six yards. Right. Okay. Third down and four. All 
one. Here you go. Three receivers left. Penix in the gun, fakes the snap, now looks to the sideline for the play. They have to, everybody's looking at this. Yeah, everybody's sideline. looking. They get some and interesting, time, 13, interesting 12, signs to get the message. 11, 9, 8. Six seconds. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Four, three seconds. Three, timeout, timeout. Timeout. Oh, come on. Didn't like what he saw. I remember before, years ago, when uh, I used to watch the Huskies, they would have two students giving signals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two, it was kind of cool. it was, I don't know if they still do that. Well, they, I think the quarterbacks do give signals. Yeah, and, and, and sometimes yeah, but, one guy but, has one set, yeah, the other, they're doing all know, kinds of hand signals. you don't know who Yeah, gonna... one of them's the real one, the other one's the <laughs> fake. And now they, if you look at the silence, they have signs, yeah. different posters and signs and right. all kinds of fun, funky symbols. And yeah. I don't know how they, yeah, I don't know I idea what goes into the calls, but it's pretty entertaining. Yeah, Sonny Six Killer, oh, he was my favorite quarterback at that time. Of course, uh, you know, Eventually, Sonny became an insurance agent. Wasn't didn't he do broadcasting? Didn't no, he broadcast he, he for a didn't, didn't know he never did. Yeah. I goes he, that goes he a few good. years back. Yeah, he was good. He was uh, Sonny Six Killer. He cool was uh, portrayed once in Time Magazine. You know, Sonny Six Killer. Um, it's a great name. Oh yeah, <laughs> perfect, right? You know, <laughs> touchdown, six <laughs> points, Six yeah. Killer. <clears throat> Yoda Soda said, I'm a Clemson fan because my grandpa on my mom's side loves Clemson, but I also cheer for the Huskies because my dad loves them. <laughs> and it's always funny how uh, people's affiliations, some, some people become huge fans of colleges and they have no connection there. They didn't go there. They don't even mm -hmm. necessarily have a family member who went there. They just decided, I just like the Huskies or I like the Cougs. And, yeah, yeah. You know, and uh, that just I guess becomes that's a, how it is, you know. Oh. I, I think it's funny too because sometimes they uh, they talk about you know oh. like uh, uh, when it comes I'm to the say it's not, this that is on mute. Oh, I, I I unmuted it just oh, now, so we're good now. Yeah. But the um, you know the sometimes the you know the UW and Wazoo fans dislike each other so much that if one of the other schools teams actually has a chance to succeed, let's say it goes to a national championship, they would rather see, well, I don't know, maybe it's different on a national championship, but even in a playoff or whatever, they'll yeah. root against their rival rather than root for the team that's coming from the state just because they dislike them so much. That's right. They would rather see another team, even though I think it's good for the state. You know, I think if, if, let's say, Wazoo went to a national championship or went a playoff game, I'd root for them. I'd want them to, you know... Or represent Washington if, if, to win, if, uh, especially if, if it's against Wazoo, one of those teams that you always see. The championship, uh, but some people won't. They'll be like they'll uh, they'll root even harder against them just oh. because it's they don't want to see their state rival, you know, succeed. It's even yeah. worse than a team you don't care about. I guess about. that's what you call human nature. Yeah, you know? it's kind of funny how that goes. Oh, wow. let's see where we had. 78, only two, uh, 22 more to, to 50, 100. So hit me up, guys. All right. All right, here we are from the commercial after that timeout. Wow. Yeah, so Kalen DeBoer, I he's the new coach this coach this year. got a good big raise, huh? Extending well, his contract. Well, I mean, this is his first, this is his first year because they fired last year's coach. Mid season, yes. but they and they brought it. him in, and he's had the most successful start in Husky history to get nine wins. Penix to throw, rolls left, got it. First, First down. down to the 39 yard line. That's good for a Huskies. First, First down. Sometimes this sign gets conf makes the camera confused. Let me lower it down a little bit. Yeah. All right, first and 10 at the 40-yard line. Two receivers either side. Penix looking to the sideline again for the play. Look at the left tackle. He doesn't even look to the sideline. He just looks to uh -huh. the quarterback. Uh -huh. Single setback to his right. Claps his hands for the snap. He's looking. Good protection. Oh, Throws right side. He's got him. Number 11, McMillan. Ooh. For the first down and out of bounds. That's a There's good no enough flag for, for some Huskies. Husky first down. Oh, uh oh. Yeah. Where'd my button go? Uh oh. 
It happens sometimes. Nope. Oh, my first down button getting, stopped working. Ten yards at a time. All right, here we go. To the Cougar 49-yard line, first and 10. Clap, handoff, up the middle. Actually, Ooh. off tackle to the left. It gets about two, and it's right, that's it. buried there. Second and eight. Here, let me get some of those. Got to try some of those nachos. Yeah. Andy says, I wish I could subscribe twice, Norb. Haha, ha. I can make alt accounts, though. That's true. But I'm good with just you guys watching who haven't done it. <coughs> Give me a subscribe. That'd be awesome. All right, here we go. Second down and eight. Snap. Penix to throw. Looks left. Throws. Fires quickly to the tight end. Ooh. Into the 36 yard line. Right, he's been getting all the first good downs. for another Husky first down. Oh. Yeah, that worked that time. <laughs> he's so quick. He's got a really quick uh, release. Quick reaction, release. And it's strong because he can go you know, like sideline to either sideline really quickly and yeah, deep. He, he could, pretty amazing. He can do it. Slowly but surely, he's moving the ball. Two receivers right, one left. Snap. Play action. Looking, looking. He's got a clean pocket. Oh, Throws oh. deep right side. Oh, overthrew no. him. Had him. Holding. Mm. I think that looks like they must have miscommunicated because he was so op so off. Yeah. Like he went in instead of out. I think he was expecting him to go out because he seemed to be Could doing be. a post and all of a sudden he had to try to yeah, Switch miscommunication the there because it looks like it was really he had the far. step on the defender, yeah. he was open. I think they just got their routes mixed up or timing mixed up. Second and ten. Nine oh one left in the first half. First quarter. Three receivers right. Panics. Still getting signals. Six, Talking to the five. line. Five seconds left. They gotta get quick. Three, two, one. Snap it. Snap it. Does this a whistle? They had to call another timeout. I was wondering. They're like Wow, two time outs already. Mm. Jeez. That's terrible. Wow, with only nine minutes left in the first quarter, they had to burn their second time. I hope that doesn't uh, have an issue here. He didn't look at the. Uh... So on your trip to Germany, Dad, what was your what was your favorite place to visit? Well, yeah, I know you were started at Munich because that's where the game was, right. and then you went to Salzburg and finished, and then uh, Vienna, Vienna, and then back to Munich. Munich to go home. But in Munich, what's very popular is uh, they call it Marienplatz. Okay. And this is where you have that uh, church in there. I guess it's the Marian church. And up, up, up there they have this. Uh, at a certain time or every hour, when the bell starts ringing, then there there will be uh, figurines that will be marching, uh, going out. You know, and a lot of people are taking videos of it. And figurines, so it's like a little. Yeah, little, little um, you know how it is with the, the German clocks. thing. They have a lot of uh, little uh, figurines, mm -hmm. or figures, uh, and this would be just like coming out of the uh, of the tower, mm, okay. you know, and with music and everything. That's pretty good. You've never seen that before. That's your first time seeing that. Oh no, I, I no, I haven't been to uh, Munich. Uh, for a long time, and since 1965, but we were existed. in Munich uh, in 1965 for the uh, what we call the Carnival Fest. They call it, which is actually uh, you know they call it Fasingszeit, but it's more of a um, Mardi Gras, mm. you know, and that's where that's everybody not... becomes 
obviously uh, either drunk or crazy. It's not Oktoberfest related, is it? Yeah, have to, huh? Is it Oktoberfest? Yeah. Is it part oh, of Oh, yeah, that? I guess it's called Oktoberfest too. Mm -hmm. Okay. But they call it Fassingszeit. And Fassingszeit. I remember there, uh, there was this, you, you sit in benches, right? And so many people. And they pass along uh, beer that is in a boot, in a big Natural glass boot. boot. Okay. And then they, they keep giving this boot, passing it around, and you take a zip once it gets to you. You know, so you didn't do that this time. That was oh, no, back no, in the no, 60s. No, that was right? in the 60s. This time we didn't. Yeah, what we did, we did a lot of walking, mm -hmm. a lot of walking, and we rode the subway, we rode the tram. We, oh, it's a lot of walking. Huh? I'm glad you could actually keep up and do that much walking. I know how I was able uh, to keep it up. Tiring that can be, especially for you now. And I have to uh, appreciate your sister. She really took good care of me, holding me, leading me on, because I was always very slow. Anyway. <laughs> but you made it. Slow Second and, and ten. Okay. Snap. Play action. Don't hold. Oh, hold. watch out. Throws deep left side. Oh, no oh, one there. Oh, what's the Another one miscommunication. Him? Somebody held him. <laughs> Again, just... Just uh, cougars in the uh, in the vicinity, and no husky in that even within ten yards of that football. No, nope, not much out of that play. Third and ten, and they look to the side. This seems to take a long time for them to get this figured out. I noticed. Uh, oh, here we go. More and more teams doing these uh, the, the clap snap. Are they in field goal range? That's still too far. Yeah, it's pretty far. I'd be like 53 yards. Penix rolls right. Holding, oh, holding, holding right holding. off the bat. He's going to run it out of bounds That's after holding. a gain of four, but it's probably a hold. Yeah. Unless it was something else, but usually in the vicinity of holding. Indeed, it is. So they'll redo instead of fourth down and six, and well, being we were in talking field about, we had three subscribers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thank you for subscribing, good. whoever you are. So it's going to be now out of field goal range here, which is the whole point of taking the penalty. But he's going to get forty-five the, yard line. He's going to get this. third and twenty. They're going to try to get within field goal range, if not the first down. Mm -hmm. Empty backfield, two receivers either side. Snap. They rush five. He's well protected. Throws deep right side. He's got a man. No, it's overthrown again. Had McMillan, he's but he overthrew. Been very accurate. Yeah, just when I finally told you how good he is, he's missing targets all over the place. Yeah, looks like. Oh man. Well, I know. Maybe it's he's just a little. Start, I maybe guess. he's a little amped up right now, but costly penalty, so they got to punt it now. So they will not score on their opening drive. So Washington State will get this three nothing lead and a chance to build on it. That's his name, Penix. Huh? Yeah, Michael Jun Michael Penix Jr. Snap, kick, angling left, fair catch, called, and the ball is stopped at the two. Nice job nice pinning that ball time. in deep. So, Wazoo's going to have a long field ahead of him here. So, the, uh, the Heward quarterback before. Sam. Him. So, Sam. He's, he's, he's the backup now. Yeah. He's not played. At least I've not seen him on the field at all this year, so... Look at that. Wow, what a catch. You, oh, was he in mm, bounds? I didn't see him get a foot down. His foot was out. Well, here we go. So, about the Wazoo two yard line. If they could get a safety here, Norm. Hey, you never know. <clears throat> here we go. Two receivers left, one right. Snap. He's going to hand off up the middle just to get out of the traffic there, and he gets about two. To about the four yard line. Second and eight. Watson. Eight minutes left in the first quarter. That's a quick one. Oh, 
Oh, they ran it again. Wow, quick snap. They got three more know, yards. How do. That was really fast. Right. <laughs> it's going to be third down about six. Maybe five. Third and six. Third and six. If he doesn't make that, that's... Well, they got involved with a good field position. So that's they got to get to the 12-yard line. Field Two receivers position. either side. Now the running back goes to the right slot. For empty backfield, three receivers right, two to the left. They're going to rush just three guys, it looks like. Nope, they're going to blitz the linebackers. Uh -oh. Pressure pocket collapsing. Uh -oh. Nope, he gets away. Safety. He's still scrambling. Throws. Incomplete. A dangerous pass. Oh, wow. Because he was thrown against. Throwing yeah, it's a either a dangerous pass or a safety. <laughs> yeah. That guy's slippery. He gets away yeah, from trouble. Yeah, he gets away. Ward, like I'm look at it. they had him almost. Able, they, if the if the guy in the coming from the right side had taken more of an outside angle, I think he would have been trouble. But he just able to just get rid of it, and throw an incomplete pass. But that was dangerous. Good stand by yeah by yeah by Washington. They'll get the ball back somewhere around the midfield. Standing in the back of his end zone. Sixty-two long. This guy snap kick. Uh oh, where is uh -oh. it? Caught fair catch at the forty-four yard line of Wazoo. So, so that's very where, good almost that's where they were. Where they, they, they left where off. They started. So. It was somewhere up this. No? Yeah, let me have. At the uh, quarter break, I'll show you the new rivals video that I just made for tomorrow's game. Oh, okay. A little Star Wars theme to it. Oh, you guys will enjoy. It. I want to see also your birthday thing to Halina. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Although, I think the song is one of those copyrighted things, so I might, uh, it might be a risk to trigger it during the broadcast. So oh, I see. Might have to show it to you separately. Oh, no. yeah, I'll <laughs> do it. <laughs> sometimes it happens, but sometimes it gets away. All right, where are we at the subscriber count now? Let's see. We were at 81. I got to refresh the count. It's now 81. <laughs> it's still 81. Did you announce this um, broadcast at all? Uh, I didn't give I didn't give much of a yeah, not much of an of advance, a, of notice. advance notice, really. Because I'm surprised, uh, you know, Tyler. Oh, he knew Archer. about it. He knew. Oh, he's watching. Actually, he told me he was wanting to watch it with his uh, family or something. Oh, so. But that's he's all right. Normally, uh, you know, that picture. Oh, I know. Yeah, yeah, he was here earlier when I was doing the oh, earlier, was. Uh, broadcast. I should I should remind people. So, we I have a nonprofit charity called Fans for Good. It's right up there. Where is it? Right there. Fansforgood.org. Mm -hmm. And we're in the stages right now of accepting nominations for these holiday oh. grants that we give out every year, worth up to two hundred fifty dollars. And all you got to do is really easy: just go to fansforgood.org, and then go to holiday grants, and then you'll be um, taken to an, a nomination form. And there, if you know of any families who are facing any hardships or just are maybe uh, a little bit in need during the holiday season put their name put their contact information there and a little explanation as to why you feel like they deserve why something they deserve like that it? and then we will send it to our selection committee and those families that yeah. are deemed you know worthy of receiving one will get something nice in the mail before christmas so that's right. Um, That's good. That's yeah. So good. go to fansforgood.org and it, and uh, this would be a perfect time to pass, pay it forward, and help a family or an individual in need that you might know. So go check it out. I'll put it the link in here on the chat as well, so you can just click on it. Fansforgood.org. There you go. So if you know of anybody or a family. Please let us know. We can surprise them with a little something special yeah. for the holidays. All right, here we go. So Huskies in business at the 44-yard line of Wazoo. Motion, handoff, up the middle, big hole. Oh, big Bang, hole. Bang, banging ahead, and more. Keeps going. 
for about another five yards, and that's good. Barring any flags, no flags. Good for a Huskies. First down. That's about the 32. That was that. Oh, oh, my God. Good blocking. Good block. And then he gets another five. That's inside the about the 30-yard line. Empty backfield now this time. Three receivers to the right, two left. He's going to take the snap. They rush four. He's got time. Throws deep right side. Nope, overthrown again. Jeez, there's a lot of overthrown passes. Yeah. I mean, like, I mean way overthrown. <laughs> you know. I don't know. Like I said, I've never watched simply. Yeah, well, if I only saw this, I wouldn't be impressed either. But he's done uh-huh. a lot better than that. Hey, we're up to 85. So 15 more to go before we hit 50,100. Hmm. All right, here we go. Two receivers either side now. Penix in the gun with a single setback to his left. Motion McMillan to the slot. Snap. He's looking. He's going to hit McMillan. And he's pushed back immediately. That's going to be about a gain of maybe five yards, maybe four. Be third down and six. At least his receivers are. Receivers are. And they have pretty good hands. Mm -hmm. You just got to get the ball within their catch radius. Yeah, third and six. Here we go. Ball at the 26 yard line. Definitely in field goal range now. They look to the sideline, try to read the signs, figure out what the play is. I remember when we were in Little Three, League. Two. Snap it now. He does. Well, Rolls know. right. He's got time. Throws deep this time. Caught by Polk to the 10. Five. That's a touchdown. Woo! Touchdown! Touchdown, Huskies! Yeah. 6-3. They take the lead with that touchdown you know, catch that, and run. The throw was high. It was a little bit high, but he pulled it in. Yep. That's what Hulk. I was just starting to say. The, the, uh, the Look. Husky receivers are, are pretty good. Oh, the they defender fell down, too. Head. Nice blocking downfield to make yeah. sure nobody was there to hit him. Here's the extra point. Snap. Low snap. Hold is good. Kick is good. And now we got seven. Seven three. Washington on top by four. There we go. Didn't we have a running back named Polk before? Yeah. Yeah, we did. Uh, I think he actually got drafted, I think. I don't know if where he's at now. Yeah. Um shoot, what was his first name? I, I, I know I was I wonder, I wasn't sure if they're related. Any, any relation between the receiver Polk who's playing now to <laughs> <laughs> Polk, the running back from a few years ago? Or is it just a common name? Mr. Babb asks, why do people watch college football? <laughs> well, same reason you watch any team, really, right? you got to have some connection to it, whether it's... That's right. You went to school there, or you knew somebody went to school there, or you had a family member go to school there, or you just decided one day, you know what, I think I like this school. I'm going to root for them. <laughs> <clears throat> So there's the score and the clock. So it's 5.23 left in the first quarter. That was quick. Yeah, first I quarter. I already? Yeah, first quarter. We've still got, you know, another quarter, second quarter still. So oh, quarter. I half. thought you said half. No, quarter, okay, quarter. quarter. Now here we go. Here's the kick going right to left. Boom. Well, I think we're offside. I swear the guy, the guy in the line was ahead of the kicker. Yeah. <laughs> but... No flags, so apparently no violations. First and ten, Wazoo. I was thinking that because uh, the the wide receivers that didn't seem to be in sync with the ball as far as when, when he throws it, maybe I'm saying maybe they were being held or something. Yeah, right, sometimes yeah, yeah, they disrupt their pattern because they grabbed them early on and there. But there was nothing. That's a hard part of the TV broadcast. You can't watch that. There was no flag. There you go. He's going to throw a rolling right, swings it to the running back, and he's tackled immediately Ooh. after a gain of about four yards. Second and six. 
Watson, the receiver. Everybody goes no huddle. Snap. Hand off up in the middle. Oh, breaks a tackle, but then tackled immediately after about a gain of one, maybe two. Mm -hmm. Third down and four. Fine, yeah. I remember back in Little League, the way we'd get the plays in is like, whoever's on the sideline ready to go in, the coach tells him, okay, power right, 26 lead. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, and then he'll run in there. The other guy comes out, and then he would tell the quarterback what the play is, and the quarterback would tell everybody what the play is. And that's how we did it. It was just mm -hmm. one person would keep relaying the message, and you hope they didn't screw it up. Third and four, ball at the 20 uh, or 31 yard line. Snap. He's going to throw. Oh, mm. a good tackle. He was that thrown was to good. the left side, before, short of the sticks. So he's tackled immediately. So it's going to be fourth and yeah. one. Up to the side. Do they want to stay out there and go for it or play it safe and punt Actually, this ball? They should punt this ball. One, yeah. It was short, though. They're going to punt. Yeah, They're going to punt. That would, be, that would be a bad move to. Go oh, for it. So they're going to kick. So now UW's got to quickly change their personnel. Well, that would be terrible if they don't get that first down. And it, if I mean, they if, they, if, it, if it works, it's a mm -hmm. gutsy call, but you miss, you miss, and all of a sudden you're in field goal, immediate field goal range. Look at all these things. They stack like four, four receivers on the left. It's a fake! And it's complete to the 45. Still going 40. Down to the 30-yard line. A fake. That was wow. Well, there's and there's always that. <laughs> we didn't talk about that option. Yep. So interesting. They so they they moved everybody out, split to the right, and so they had like four guys on the right side. You know where you normally have the gunners. Instead, the guy who was on the left side, um, he just went like a seam route, and he was wide open. Nobody covered him. That's the thing is you know in a tricky fake. It's not something you plan for. The, the punter. Pattern? Yeah, the punter just grabbed it and threw it. Reminds me of the Rams. The Rams used to do it all the time under Jeff Fisher. Here's the throw. He's scrambling again, doing his Russell Wilson invitation. Throws it out of bounds. Second and ten. Yeah, remember the Rams? They would mm -hmm. always do trick plays. They they use an Evan Hecker at the time was the was the um, punter for for the Rams. He was a former uh quarterback, well, so he could I throw the football. That this, the punter was able to throw that ball. Pretty good. Oh my God. Boy, this is wide open. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, but I mean, you know, it's not easy. Yeah, I guess so. I think I could have even thrown that pass. <laughs> it was so open. Second down and 10. Oh, Huskies running all off and down the field. I think they give them time to substitute. It's not like the the NFL where no. guys have to rush off the field and beat the snap. Four men uh, down line and two receivers. Actually, empty backfield. Two left, three right. He's looking left. Now he looks right. Now he's scrambling. I still see he's just shifting around, still looking forever. The throw steps up, and he's going to go down at the 36-yard line. He had like that 10 seconds back there. They must have had awesome coverage downfield because he was just Why standing he like... destroyed away? Mm, 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 and never you know, got rid of it. Why did he not destroy it away? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He, Almost. He could have destroyed it away. I'm surprised, but I'm happy about it though. Third and fifteen. Yeah, but I mean, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Why? Oh yeah. Is it really that open? I, I, yeah. yeah. Throw it away. Thirty-five yard line pushes it out of at least not close field goal range. Since he only barely made it a fifty. Looking, looking, throws left near side, complete. But he's short of the sticks. It's going to be a fourth and two. So they're going to decide. Have to decide. Do they uh, want to kick it? Take a field goal here, or try to go for it and. They're gonna go field goal. Well, I don't know, the receiver's staying out there. They might go. With two minutes to go for two the minutes first, to the first quarter. quarter. I mean, time is really not an issue. It's really a question of are they happy settling for a field goal or do they want to try to be aggressive and keep this drive alive? They are gonna go, apparently. Three receivers to the left, one right, and single setback to his left. Ward in the gun. Motion. He's going to... Oh, it's a good play. And he got the first down. You see it coming. So it was, a, it was a kind of like a bubble screen, but it was to the receiver on the far left. He basically mm -hmm. went motion 
to the towards the line of towards That's the pretty good towards the tackle the second and uh, as he got uh, there they just snapped it and he just he was kind of open because he was basically shielded by a couple of receivers that's not a bad strategy that was so they're good. inside the red zone at the 18 yard line first down hmm well two gutsy plays so far fourth down and a fake field goal to keep this drive going mm-hmm. snap he's gonna throw looking pump fakes under pressure hit him hit him got him but he Thank got four. God. He escaped the pocket. Got chased out. The good thing, if he didn't tackle him, I think he might have been gone for a touchdown. Yeah, looks like Look at, no this hot guy's home. pretty fast. Yeah. These guys are really Look quick. Look how, how Snap. fast this guy is. Throws wide open. Oh, he dropped it. He dropped it, and he was open for a touchdown. You know, the, the Cougars. It looks like they're taking advantage of how the Huskers are lining themselves. Right. Yeah, they, they, the Huskers keep looking at the sides. <laughs> yeah, they're not ready. They're, they're, they're not really ready. not ready. They're they're trying to figure out what they're going to do. The ball was kind of thrown high, and the I think the receiver knew that the this defender was, was coming. This guy was late, actually, if you think about he it. He was late, but he, he was, was able late. to he hit the guy. He was still looking at the sideline. Right. It's third <laughs> and six. Snap. He's going to throw. Looking, looking, looking. He's under Come pressure. On. Escapes. Uh -oh. He's going to get the first down and more. Touchdown. Jeez. What's your thing? Damn Ward is something else. That guy can really scramble. 14 yard Damn touchdown. Ward. So it's seven to it's a pity. Nine uh, to seven with the extra point. You know, it's crumbling Sheesh. quarterback. Look, there's a chance one guy See, on the outside that. had him He's right there. Cool. But then he he just bounced it outside and nobody could catch him. He is very quick. Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's pretty shifty, even when it looks like somebody's about to have him. He just so a 9 7. Oh, wow. And about to be 10 7. That, oh, 10 7. That's the point coming up here. Yeah. Well, we got a good game coming up here. A couple of, call it lucky or gutsy calls, but kept that alive to get the touchdown. Otherwise, they would have been still down by four with um, UW with the football. All right, here's the extra point. Kick is up and good. So it's 10 to 7 with 53 seconds left in the first quarter. Hmm. Good drive. Of course, that fake field that fake punt's not gonna happen again that's a one that's a one-time deal right there can it still happen yeah but they'll be they'll be prepared for it if it they're in that situation again they you just think. got them really sur surprise them trick play it's every often you can you know, try to run one, one what's more than really one trick weird one. with me now no no I, i'm not really rooting for anybody because I haven't seen anyone, any of them. So I just look at it. I appreciate mm -hmm. what the Cougars are doing, and I appreciate what the Huskies are doing. But I'm not really rooting for any special, mm -hmm. you know. You're not connected that, mu that much to these teams. I haven't really connected, mm -hmm. although you could say that I'm a Husky fanatic. Because, you know, both of you, mm -hmm. Monica and... You have one grandson who went to Wazoo and yep. two kids who went to UW. So I think UW yep. gets the, get, okay. wins that one. Kick return to the 21. He's stuffed immediately right there. Oh, my gosh. That's how you're going to get injured. Yeah. All right. Well, seven. Husky's got an answer here. Down by three with 47 seconds left in this first quarter. Good game. Just want a good game, really. It is. Blowouts are no fun. Not that you're the one doing the blowouts, but blowouts are boring. We want close games. What is right, CFP? Hmm? What, what is CFP? 
Where did you see that? Is that the conference? CFP? Yeah, the conference. Oh, ah, there's so many conferences. I don't know all the name of them. Penix to throw. Throws to the left. Complete. Breaks a tackle. Oh, and I think he got the he first got the down. First down. Wait, no, they said he stepped out of bounds. It'll be nine oh, yards. Okay. Zoop. If I were the one coaching these guys, I would watch out for that side throw. That's the only thing he does all the so time. So far, huh? he's going he's gonna to hit one of these deep, I'm telling you. He's got a good deep ball. He just has been off a little bit. Handoff. He's going to be short. I think he got a half a yard and stuffed there. So it's third and half. He could have just held on to that ball. Oh, the quarterback, right? Yeah, like, that, like a right. read option. All right, so time ticks down. That's the end of the first quarter. So after one, 10 7, <coughs> Wazoo. All right, I want to show you this. Uh, Rivals video. Star oh, okay. Wars inspired video uh, for the Raiders Seahawks game tomorrow. Here you go. Take a look. Okay. Hello? Who is this? This is Darth Vader, Lord of the <laughs> Sith and big time Raiders fan. No way! Darth Vader? <laughs> awesome! Hey man, I loved you in Empire Strikes Back. Best movie of the series, by the way. I personally like my cameo in Rogue One. Oh, that was pretty cool. You kicking ass and throwing rebels all over the place with the Force. Thank you. Except, it was a little out of left field. What do you mean? Like, why didn't you just do that again at the beginning of Episode 4? Could have saved a lot of Stormtroopers' lives, you know. But, I get it. They didn't have the visual effects capabilities in the 70s like they do now. No, we were simply following standard Imperial boarding procedures. Mm-hmm. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> anyway, why are you calling me? I'm calling to inform you that your seacocks are going down tomorrow. Okay, why? Because the Raiders are strong with the dark side of the Force. <laughs> well, the dark side hasn't helped you that much since you're only 3-7. and seven. But I agree, I think the Raiders are a better team than their record shows. And we're only favored by three and a half points, so it might be a lot closer than a lot of people think. If you only knew the power of the dark side. Yeah, well, I agree. The Raiders' strength is their power running game. Josh Jacobs is one of the best running backs in the league, and the Seahawks have struggled against teams that run the football well. Stopping Jacobs is the key to victory for the Seahawks. Conversely, we need to dominate the run game. When we do, we almost always win. Are you forgetting about Devontae Adams, one of the most powerful weapons in the galaxy? Of course not, Darth. Adams has been a thorn in our side for years. Years, but we also have one of the better secondaries in the league. The Seahawks have kept opponents to under 23 points the last five games and are fifth in the league in turnovers. My Raiders are coming off a huge win last week against the Broncos, who have one of the best defenses throughout the star system. It's true, but the Broncos' offense sucks. Sorry, Russ. Geno Smith is slaying the league like a Jedi Knight with his league-leading 72.8% completion percentage, 17 touchdowns and only four picks. And the Raiders' secondary pff, is one of the worst in the league. I think the offense will get back on track this week. Well, don't you know only real men wear black? Okay, but the Raiders will be wearing white tomorrow. Oh, nevertheless, the Seahawks will lose. I have foreseen it. It is your destiny. Dude, you really have to ease off the dark side cliches, bro. They're getting kind of stale. I find your lack of faith disturbing. <laughs> I hate this I movie, but there's an ending. I think it is. Who played it? Oh, come on, man. I was just playing along. Yeah, I find your lack of faith disturbing. <laughs> you crack me up. I love you, man. You're the best. Oh, okay. <laughs> there you go. Did, did, you, did you play the voice also? Oh, yeah, that's me. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> a little uh, sound effect, yeah. voice deepening. And, uh, and it's, it's pretty uh, good, so it's actually. Pretty good. So there you go. All Hope right. you enjoyed that. If you hadn't seen it earlier, that's a little encore presentation of mm. the Rivals video in honor of our game tomorrow. So hope you guys like that one. Um, it's twenty-seven seventeen, Hawks fan for life. Eighty-eight says we'll be winning twenty-seven seventeen. I said twenty-eight twenty-four uh, earlier today. Yeah, we're only three and a half point favorites, so why not go with just over three and a half points? Uh, we'll see. <clears throat> All right, back to the game. Perfect timing. So okay. second quarter action. Huskies down by three, with the ball at their own. 30-yard line. It's the third and inches. 
So I see a handoff coming in here. Motion. Handoff. Middle. Go. And he gets it. He needed to have one, and he got three. It's good for Huskies. First down. Still out of time. All right. 14.50, early second quarter. Here we go. At their own 33-yard line, two receivers either side. Penix pretty much always in the gun. And he looked to the sideline for the sideline. Side instead of. Snap. He's going to throw. He's got time. Oh, oh under pressure. Swings it to the running back, but it's off his feet. Yeah. Wouldn't have gone anywhere anyway, so incomplete. That second time, time. They got pressure that time. They kind of almost got to the quarterback. They almost did. That's the first time they've kind of first even time. got a hand on him. Second down and 10. Clock stops. Oh. All right, here we go. Tighter formation, two receivers either side. Penix will claw, lap his hands, take the shotgun snap. Looking, he's got time. Pump face, throws. Oh, he was open again, and he overthrew him. Polk down, streaking down the right sideline, just way overthrown. I don't know what's happening, but his mechanics or whatever, he's just, that's like five overthrows, like yeah. bad overthrows. And he had them open, too. So they go hurry up here, third and ten. They're going to do the old look, look at the sideline. Yes, they do. What? Three receivers left. They need to get to the 42, 43-yard line if they want to get a first down here. Here we go. Oh, come on. You're going to have time moving, out again. Moving, moving. Five Six, seconds five, on the play four, clock. Three, two. Got to snap it now. Snap it now. Go. Snap it now. Barely got it off. Whew. No, they're going to say he didn't get it. That's Ooh, what I get, said. He gets shoved late and a flag. Uh -oh. There was a flag. That was some pushing and shoving uh -oh. because Penix was knocked down after the whistle. He got a delayed game. I thought he got it off in time, but apparently not. It's going to be third and 20, the third and 15. The seem to be alert. Yeah, it's taking a long time to get set on both sides of the football. He keeps, he, he keeps uh, changing the thing. Well, that's noisy, too. So, of course, it probably affects his ability to get everybody lined up. Sure enough, a delayed game. Should can you... Able, can you uh, if you're on the coach, can you say you don't accept that when you do that? No, but why would you? Why would you not take five extra yards? Loss of down. No, no, it's not a loss of down. Huh? It's not. It's a dead ball penalty, so oh. they, it kind of has to happen. It's like a false start. So That's I don't think I you mean. have the choice. You cannot, I don't you think cannot, you can decline um, it. I don't think so. It. And you wouldn't want to anyway, but... Third and 15... Hopefully they get this thing Nobody set up. Is. Two no. receivers to the left, one right. He's got to get 15 yards here. Snap. Four-man rush. He's got time. Throws deep left side. He's got it wide open. Boom. What a catch. He needed 15. He got about 22. And that's good for another Husky. First down. Dude's a hazard with the super chat. He said, what's up? Would look at the sideline. Besides disrupting the flow of the game, I think it's stupid. I remember when the Ducks did it years ago. Mm -hmm. That's a, I don't know. It's a, it's a weird, time-consuming thing. But I don't know. this now they're not you looking. First down, the Wazoo forty-seven. Oh, what happened? Timeout. Timeout. Washing. Wait, Wazoo. Wazoo timeout. Okay. Hi, girls. They're still awake? Oh, yeah. They uh, they were running some errands earlier. <clears throat> well, tomorrow it should be a pretty, um, pretty wet game, I think. I think it's uh, expecting rain tomorrow. Let's see. 
There's my phone's about to go into an update. What do we got here? Are you in the Discord? Discord? We have Richard Nguyen. It's always there watching. What's up, Richard? Hey, good to see you. And we have Landy, Landon Boss. Landon Boss in the Discord. Landon, what's going on? I'm doing well. I remember you from the uh, <laughs> from the uh, Cardinals game. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. yeah. Well, we've had two Cardinals games. Which one was it? The home one or the away one? Obviously, the, the away uh, one. Mexico, uh, the Mexico one. Oh. The one. Oh. Oh, oh! The, not the Seahawks game, but the 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 the, the beating that the Forty ers put on the Cardinals. Yeah, yeah. I was like after I was like after halftime, I'm like I'm not gonna watch it. <laughs> yeah, I was. Uh, ugh. That was a brutal, brutal, brutal game. Yeah, brutal. Yeah, brutal because we were we yeah, were hoping the, the Cardinals could actually pull it off and knock the Forty ers down big, but man, the Forty ers looked yeah. good. I mean, you now, the, are you rooting for the Huskies? Are you a Husky fan or a Coop fan? Uh, I mean. My my college just got knocked out of the playoffs, so I mean, uh, we were going to the Big Ten championship game. My my uh, my college is Iowa, but like, eh. <laughs> not happening. Yeah, you guys so, lose. Bowl, uh, so I don't know what bowl we're gonna be in, but I'm a Washington fan. I I was a Washington fan for a long time. Oh, okay, so we got a fellow Husky fan in here. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, right. I have family who I fa I have family members who go to Washington college. Oh, okay. All right, that's usually kind of the case. Where are you here. watching from? Oh yeah, yeah. Where are you from? Are you in uh, Iowa? Uh, yeah, Iowa. Yeah. Oh, okay. College. Gotcha. All right. Well, back to the game. Thanks for uh, checking in. Appreciate it, man. All right, let's get to this. First down. Oh look, he's thirty-six yards, and he'll be he'll break four thousand yards for the season. That's amazing. For our first year. 47 yard line. Here we go. Snap. He's going to throw. He's looking. Pump fakes goes deep. He's got him. Touchdown. Woo! There you go. Finally. He's got his range. 47 yard Seahawks. touchdown down the left sideline. He broke the record now. Uh, oh, he, he got the 36 right no. there. So it breaks 4,000 and then some with that touchdown and gets the lead 13 to 10 with the extra point to come. It was a pump fake that got him. Did you see that? Yeah. A little pump fake just enough to get the corner to bite. And then he sent him down the sideline and finally didn't overthrow a pass. Yeah, he didn't overthrow it. All right, here we go. The extra point is up and good. It's 14 to 10, just like that. 13:27 left in the half. There it is. There, that was a good view of the uh, that ISO the cam on the receiver. Number, number one just kept running. But if, but if the corner's watching the quarterback, that's right. He's gonna want to try uh -huh. to jump that route, and that's where the and double move. Besides, the works. other wide receiver over here kind of stopped like he was going to stop, oh, and okay. the other guy just kept going. So. 4,011 yards for Michael Penix Jr. That is a lot of yards when you think about it. In 10 games, mm -hmm. or no, 12 games. This is the 12th game, so that's well over 30, 300 yards a game. That time of possession is pretty even, 809 to 824. Huskies with that drive, total yardage, 168 versus 120-something. Uh, you see what Jordan uh, R14 said? Which one? Oh, jo Jonathan if Ford. available, would you Ford rather Huskies. settle draft with Will Anderson or just Jalen yeah. Carter? I'm not familiar with both of them. <clears throat> uh, sure. uh oh, 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 jeez. On the kick return, he got hit by a, a husky, then hit his own guy like a mm. pinball. Bang, bang. <laughs> yeah, but he got good, good um, return to the thirty. Fable, would you rather see how draft Will Anderson or Jalen Carter? Yeah, I'm not, I'm not real familiar with all the college quarterbacks coming mm. out, but I don't know. Right now, 
there's talk now about Seattle trying to extend Geno Smith now to like a not long term but medium range contract, maybe like a three year deal. Have they Something, signed him? Not, not, yet. not yet. I mean, yeah, he probably won't because he's going to try to see what money he can get from whoever's out there. I'm sure a lot of teams are going, ooh, it's Geno Smith looking good. Yeah. Someone will probably be willing to pay him $30 million a year or more. Yep. He's had a good year. There's a nice stop, run stop for basically about a yard, maybe. Not quite. Second down to nine. But, yeah, so Geno's yeah. going to get paid. And, and, and to do that, he's got to win tomorrow. Well, every game he wins, the more he's adding yep. dollars to his checkbook potential. So he's definitely... And there's there's also certain clauses, escalators in his contract this year that if he achieves certain milestones, he he gets more money. So I don't know what exactly what those escalators are. False start. Uh-oh. Uh, but they're probably related to the number of games that he plays, probably maybe wins, maybe a playoff escalator. Mm-hmm. Like he can actually get them to the playoffs and he'll get another bump up in pay. So, which is good. That's a good kind of contract to have. That way they have to really earn also, that money. Also, maybe it's got to do also with number of interceptions. Mm-hmm. Or? Yeah, probably... Yeah, maybe yards thrown, yards. just like the 4,000 here. I'm sure he won't get. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Who knows? Maybe uh, if he keeps going at the rate, he could hit a pretty high yardage mark this year. Second and 14 after the fall start, they're on 26. Snap. He's going to oh. hand. Nope. It's play action. Like- Under pressure throws. Middle. Complete. Oh, wow. For a first down and more into UW territory. At the 47 yard line, that's an easy play. Yeah, it looks like he, he just stood there. And just, just a simple. T- he was yeah, very receiver, cool. Just receiver, just. It's cool. Just down. He basically just did a quick in route. This time, hit to the. Oh! oh! Tried to hit the running back on the flat. He never got his hands on it and dropped it. So it's second and 10. That could be dangerous. Yeah, because he bounces, keeps yeah. juggling that ball. The defender can pick it off. <clears throat> they like to go fast, though. Wazoo, this is one of the faster-paced teams. I mean, they they like to snap the ball quick. Yeah, look, <clears throat> the Huskies are not even ready yet. Look, they keep looking. Do they allow that? But see, the, the, the ref st- stands at the ball, so he gives a certain amount of time for the, the team's substitutions to be made. Snap, throw to the right side in the flat. Oh, breaks the tackle. He's down the sideline. Ooh, 15 yards and a first down. Jeez. That was quick. And they go up-tempo, up-tempo, up-tempo. Mm-hmm. First and 10. See, the, see how the ref stands there? He's waiting for that ref to give him the signal that it's okay for the right. lady there. And then he says, okay, oh, now they can so they can't just hurry snap it when they're not ready completely. There's certain, I'm not sure what the rule is, but here you go. There's a so that guy over there. there. Snap, looking, looking. He's going to throw, throws. Mid- oh, he had a wide Ooh, open I receiver for was, first down. That could have been intercepted. Hit. I think he threw it behind him. I know, but he had, the, a, he there, had to go backwards for it. Waiting in there. Yeah, he just was not quite in the right trajectory. 14 to 10. 11.31, clock stopped. So there he goes. Oh, now he says, okay, go. Guy. Oh, he already gave him the signal. He did? Yep. He keeps his arms out like this oh, to I wait, see. and then he goes, snap. It's going to be uh, another play action. This guy throws all the time. Throws deep. Broken up. That was a good defense. That was a good defense. It was a little underthrown because it seemed like the receiver had to stand there and kind of wait to jump for it, you know? See, he had slowed down. He had to slow down. Ooh. He had it in his hands, actually, yeah. the receiver did. That's a good play to break that up. Turned his head around so he doesn't get past interference. Yeah, that was a good play. But Could've, it seems that he doesn't even exert too much effort. Yeah, he just kind of flicks it, huh? Yeah. Just kind of... He's got a good He hand. doesn't have to put a whole lot of... Motion. He just snaps his arm. Three receivers to the left. Third and ten. He's got to get a first down here if he wants to get the drive going. Uh-oh. Throws deep right side. Oh, he had a man open too. Yeah. And he, inter- he, he caught it. That would have been touchdown. touchdown. But 
overthrown and it's fourth and ten. Can they make a field goal from here? What's the yardage? Look at him. He's just streaking down the field and he just overthrew him. No, uh, the guy was too far. Farrell was too far. So, so they're just going to go for it. Not, not in field goal range. It would have been a 53, 52 yard field goal. So empty backfield, three receivers left, two right. 11 17 left in the first half. Fourth and 10, ball at the 30. Four yard line of UW. Snap. He's going to throw. They rush four. He's under trap pressure. Brits gets away. He's still up. Throws. Wide oh. open to the 10. Five. He's in for the touchdown. How the heck did he get away from that pressure? Oh my I tell gosh. You. This guy is amazing. Touchdown, Cougars. Sheesh. He's good. Quarterback. You know? I swear, he, they had him. Like two guys. Look at this. Pocket collapses. Got his hands on him. Then he just... And then he ran to his own guy. And then by that time, everybody's all scrambling around free. And... Oh, my gosh. What a play. <laughs> this dude is... <laughs> now, what if he misses this? <laughs> See, they still kick it from the... The ball's still set at the three-yard line. So, it's only a you know 20-yard kick. And it's good. So... 17-14, Wazoo answers with 11.05 left. Uh, they take back the lead by three. Look at this. Boom. Watch him dead. Bam. And he still can't get. Hey, guys named Cam. Cam Ward, Cam Newton. Tough to bring down. <laughs> yep. Just Cam's a good name to have. quarterback, all right. Jeez, Cameron Ward. I wonder what the record mm. is. What's what's their record? Do you know? Oh, Wazoo. Mm -hmm. They're seven and four. Okay. So yeah, they're bowl eligible. Uh, yeah, not ranked, but they're four and four in the conference. UW is six and two in the conference. They've lost to UW has lost to Arizona State and uh, UCLA. Those are the two losses. Wow, that's a fun game. Two good quarterbacks going at it. <clears throat> Let's see, how's the subscriber count going? How close are we to 5,100? Nope, inch closer, 5,090 now. Let's see if we can get that thing up to 5,100 today. 10 more to go. Part of the reason why you haven't been able to watch any Husky games is that you, you don't have them on your any of your channels at home, right? You don't have Pac-12 Network, and you don't get P ESPN either? No. So that's always the hard part, some of these games, unless they're on the local channels, like sometimes they're on ABC, Besides, I don't. Fox, but you're not that into it anyway, huh? It's different because it seems like I didn't have any... Uh that he decided to really watch the game. You know what I mean? Well, it doesn't help if you can't get the games to watch. But mm -hmm. you start watching some. I started watching some early on. I was like, oh, this guy's pretty good. Kind of got hooked. <clears throat> and tomorrow, I told you my, my uh, buddy Rob's going to come to the game. Mm. And, uh, Portland, huh? Yep. We... We used to go to a few games together, usually like Raiders, Seahawks, preseason games. I know he's a Raider fan. Yep, long time Raider fan. He's going to be showing up late, though, because he has to come from work. I don't know why he likes the Raiders, though. You know, he told me when he was a kid, because he started watching them when he was in elementary school. He said he just liked the the uniforms and the pirate logo. You know, on there. It, it hasn't changed. Madden was the coach. Mm -hmm, John Madden yeah. was the coach of the Raiders, yep. But yeah, he just liked their uh, the logo with the Raider with the eye patch. Mm -hmm. and they're one of the few teams that have not changed their logos. You know, nothing's really changed over the years. They keep the same color scheme, same uh, same logo. There's not a lot of teams. I wonder how many teams out there have not changed their logos. I think Dallas. Uh, I think Green Bay. Well, no, Green Bay changed a long time ago. We got Raiders. Who else? 
Who else's logos haven't changed? That'd be a trivia question. How many how many NFL teams' logos have not changed since their inception? Mm-hmm. That'd be a good question to see who knows out there. Eleven minutes. People are googling. Man, this is just the first half. This is gonna be a high scoring game. It seems. Like. It seems like nobody's. Well, they've had a couple of. We haven't punted. No, we punted once, and they punted. Once, right? I know that's just been scoring drive after scoring drive. All right, here we go, kicking off. They hardly run. It's like pass, 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 pass. Kick will go out of bounds, and the end zone out of bounds. Touchback. Well, you double try to answer. Down three. You know, games like this, it doesn't even matter what your, um, mm-hmm. it doesn't matter what your record is or anything like that. It's like all that stuff can all change in a, in these in these uh, rivalry well, let's games. Let's see how the Huskers will respond to this. This is something. Okay. All right, here we go. Once it gets two receivers bearings, left and right, I think he'll be all right. He's starting to get hot here. Two receivers left, one right. Or two receivers right, one left. Pettis to throw. Goes deep. Middle of the field. He's got a man. Oh, oh just over his fingertips. Odunze, who had the first touchdown, was close to getting underneath that, but the cover is just right there. He had a step on him, but then... Uh, just out of reach. About another six inches he might have had mm-hmm. that one. And it's getting a little bit closer. He's still slightly ahead. At least it's not too bad. Yeah. He still had a much better second quarter. Three receivers left, one right. Motion to the right. Handoff this time. Breaks the tackle. First down. Plows through these defenders for a 19-yard gain. And a Husky first down. Hola, papa. Yep. That was a huge... Huge uh, hole. Oh, look, no, 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 no. They're not doing that. Huh? No, now there they go. There, there's that sideline thing. So they change formations a little bit. Send the receivers to the left, two to the right. He's got plenty of time on the play clock. Penix with the re- running back right behind him. He's going to fake the handoff. He's going to be play action. He's got time. Throw his left sideline. Takes it. McMillan to the 35, to the 30, and out of bounds there. And that will be another Husky first, first down. Uh, but you know, that, that thing is still high. high. I know. I'm glad that Wait. these guys have... have he's he's had to reach... They've had to reach up and grab him, for mm-hmm. sure. A little bit high. Ten minutes left in the first half. Husky's on the move again at the 30-yard line of Wazoo. Trips right. The running back goes motion, swings to the left. It's going to be a trick play. He's going to throw. Throws it back to Penix. Penix is going to just run it to 30. First down, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown! (laughs) (laughs) What a play. Oh, my goodness. Michael Penix, a little trickery. He goes, Penix swings it to McMillan in the flat. McMillan turns back around, throws it back to Penix. Penix catches it near the sideline and just runs it all the way down for a touchdown. Do you think that he really was going to have to run? Or I what? thought he'd throw it again like a double yeah, pass. that's what I thought. Because it's the quarterback, right? But you know, he looked like he never was. No, I think there was no he doubt. was a planned thing. Yeah, because he never slowed down. He, yeah. didn't, he just was running all the way. Well, I guess. Wow. Wazoo with a couple with a trick play, and now you dub says of what you can do, we can do better. And he scores a touchdown on it 21 17. The extra point is good. Look at and that. And that's a nice throw. That's a long developing mm-hmm. play. But yeah. Look at all that, those blockers ahead. He's got a wall of yeah. like six blockers leading the way, and he never got touched. I thought that that guy would be 20 17. It wasn't that like much. pushing the block in the back, you mean? Yeah, yeah. Sometimes you know, if you get a little bit of something, as long as but you don't really. It was not much, right? Well, I see guys hold all the time. They'll, they'll have their hands, and you can tell they're kind of grabbing mm-hmm. a little bit. But I think as long as you don't have your hands on the outside, mm-hmm. they say if you have your hands inside, there's always a little bit of grabbing in here. They just don't want you grabbing like this. Mm-hmm. So, 
Because they always say you can wow. hold holding on to almost every play. Up and down, up and down. <laughs> no defense, no defensive. Uh, Simply like this game here. The team that will win today. So with the last, one, the last you know, one with the ball. Who, who, who has the ball last? I suppose it might be. Or who makes a mistake? Who makes a mistake. Who makes the first turnover? Yeah. Or yeah, doesn't doesn't ah, score a that's touchdown. Interesting. Yeah, right now it's just. Back and forth, back and forth, quick. Especially you, Dove. They're really scoring fast. Wow, that was that was pretty cool. I haven't seen that one yet. So right now we are just ahead four points. Or uh, is that what it is? Yeah. I'm have this not updated. Let me see here. Oh, we're not. It's not yet. There we go. Twenty-one seventeen. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Pretty cool though. Pretty interesting. Both teams are playing very well, I'd say. Yeah, UW seems to be really efficient. Hello, I am from Peru. Oh. Paul Zambrano. Paul Zambrano Hello, from Paul. Peru. Welcome to the show. GL for W. Good luck. Mm -hmm. Good luck for the win, I guess. Or good luck for Washington. <clears throat> yep, good luck for Washington. So, you think he, he's not able to watch the game, most likely, oh, from Peru? I'm sure. Or is he is from well, Peru? No, ESPN, you know, I guess if you have ESPN or ESPN yeah, the app, nice. maybe you can get it. I don't know. I'm not yeah, sure how it works in certain listening, other countries. I'd like to know if he's able to watch the game. Yeah, Paul, can you? Oh, he says, yeah. Is that is that answering the question that you're able to watch the game? It's nationally televised on ESPN if you have access to ESPN. So, Paul, are, are you able to watch the game? Here's the throw. Here's the play again. Look. Throws back. What a perfect throw, too. And then he's going 30, 25, 20, 15, 10. What a move there, too. Yeah, that push right there. Wow, that was great. Cool play design. <coughs> In Peru, there is no such sport, but I studied for a while in the USA. Oh, okay. All right, here's the kick return. 15 to the 20. Got a hole 25 up to the 30 and down there. They've been getting good returns on the kicks when they do take it out. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if uh, Paul answered the question. Is he watching the game? Or the, yeah. You know? My guess is that maybe they, he, it's not. he can't. But you never know. Andy says, so close to 5,100. I know. Let's see. Where are we at now? How do you uh, update it? 93. Seven more to go. Seven more. All right, here we go. Three receivers left. I don't know. I better ask uh, Paul, Paul whether he has subscribed. Quick screen. Boom! And he's taken down immediately for a loss of three. Woo! Nice tackle. Man, as soon as he caught that ball, it was just a med immediately. It was a bubble screen to the left. Shut him down. Bam. All right, here we go. Wazoo with the... Up tempo offense, two receivers right, mm -hmm. one left. Two players in the backfield snap. He's gonna throw again. What a surprise. Throws middle of the field. Oh, breaks the tackle first down. Gain of about 13, 14, enough for the first down. These guys never run. They throw he just everything. Goes. Two receivers right, one left. Snap. Same formation. Oh, they actually hand it off. As soon as I say they don't run, they ran. Maybe he gets about four yards. That's Watson. Second and six. Uh, yeah. Elementary, my dear Watson. With the call, with the run off the left side. Second and six at their own 45-yard line. Snap. Boy, they go quick. Look at that. Another quick pass for the first down. Now left sidelines. Brook and tackle to the 37 of UW. Man, these guys go quick. Yep. Hey, go Boy, quick. Both teams are moving mm -hmm. the ball. Wow. Boy. 
It's like you don't have a chance to breathe. Oh, so... Um, well, I can't watch answers. sports on TV. There's no broadcast in my yep. country just because of your comments on YouTube. Wow. Okay. Well, I'm glad I could bring some rarely seen mm -hmm. sports to your part of the world. Well, I don't know if Paul is, uh, has subscribed already. Yeah, hopefully. That way he could watch all of your yeah, shows, yeah, you whether won't it's miss. Seahawks or Huskies. Snap, empty backfield, he's going to throw. Looking, looking, throws deep. Oh, he's got a man. Oh, did he catch that? Did is he? that a touchdown? Yep. Touchdown. It is, it is. Or did he hit the ground first? Oh, I see. I was wondering if that ball, did I hit the ground? Because he really extended, watch. The hands. Oh, I think he caught it. He caught it, but it's not a touchdown. I got it, I think. Unless it bounced off the ground. Here we go. His knees touched, though. There. Ooh. Oh, I think it hit the ground. Oh, I think it, I think it rolled on yeah. the ground. It hit the ground. Up, oh, right. There. You can't see there, but there's one angle. You can see the ball yeah. kind of touching the ground. Right here. Watch this. Right. And his knee touched already. Look. Well, they would have been down at the one yard line, but right there. Oh, yeah. There. He, he never, right there. He had a, didn't have it under his un, the hand well, of the ball. He extended himself, really. It's a great attempt. Yeah, I think it bounced off the ground and back yep. into his lap. It's a hell of a play, though, but it shouldn't count. But they, you really had to look at every single camera angle because the only one that revealed it was that one side view camera. The other ones really didn't show it because it was his body was blocking the view. Make sure you check the side camera, <laughs> not the other ones. Check the <laughs> side camera. Oh, they, these guys are good in looking at those things. They're pretty they? accurate most of the time. Yeah. Oh, right? yeah. Headphones come He's off. He's got it already. Here we go. Here's yeah, the call. It's going to be overturned. Incomplete, like we saw. Incomplete pass. There's the view. The one camera showed it. Yep, right there. Ehings 12, thanks for subscribing. Ehings 12, Ehings 12. Oh, 96, four more to go. All right, here we go. Second and 10 from the UW 47 yard line. Two receivers either side. Ward takes the shotgun snap. He's going to play action fake. Of course, he's going to throw the right side and the slant. Good for nine yards. Third and one. <clears throat> yes. They're going quick, up tempo. Snap, handoff. Uh -oh. oh, he's not going to make. Uh -oh. oh, he did make uh -oh. it. Bounced around the corner to the twenty to the fifteen. How did that happen? It looked like he was going to get yeah, stuffed, and then the guy just bounced stuffed, it outside, and back. nobody was there to contain it. There is a flag. I saw a husky player kind of go like, "Oh, it's on the. It is on the oh, Cougs." Wow. What was the penalty? I missed it. Holding, most likely. Because, yeah, the, the Husky player acted like something happened to him. Like, hey, yeah. man. So that changes. It wasn't. They didn't say what the It must have been holding because it's 11 mm -hmm. yards, first and 20. So it was a. Uh, that's That line's wrong, actually. They need to move it back. But first and 20. Two receivers on the side. Ward in the gun. Definitely don't see a run here. Oh, ball, oh ball's oh, all oh, over the place. Oh. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Come on, hit him. Boom. Take him down. Actually got positive yards out of that, considering it was a snap got mishandled. Yep. Bounced in the air, and then they uh, grabbed it and were able to get it back now? to the line of scrimmage. No, that was, that was first down. Oh. That's second down and probably 19. 
He's oh. going to throw. Oh, it's fourth down. Yeah, yeah the count was all wrong. Oh, and he's wide open to 20. What the heck? No, you were right. It was third. They must be up because it said first to 20. I was like, wait, what? That's what I said. So now, it, uh, wide open. They're definitely not ready. They're definitely yeah, look a step at, look behind at trying to figure out what to do. They're confused. not used to this high speed. Three, six, nine, ten, eleven. First down at the twenty yard line. Snap. Pitch to the right side. He goes to about the fifteen and stop there for a five yard gain. <clears throat> Five forty-three left in the first half. Seattle up by four. That's a lot of time. Azu threatening here. Yes. Second and five. We need a turnover. Something to change the flow of things. Snap. He's got to throw. Throws to the right back on the right side. He's gone. Oh, touchdown. Yeah, touchdown. Jeez. Watson again. <laughs> Seems like it's so easy. <laughs> I know. Huh? Well, it's not been that easy. They've had to go for it on fourth down numerous occasions, but th that play looked easy. It just That was only so many seconds. Mm-hmm. Ten plays, 70 yards. Took four and a half minutes. And Wazoo gets the lead back. Wow. Kick is up and good. They're ahead again. So Wazoo takes a 24-21 lead with five minutes and seven seconds left in the first half. So let's see if... UW can uh, answer. UW will get the ball. You know that Wazoo has second half. had four, four down already successfully. Yeah, they had the punt, completed. fake punt. They had uh, the same same drive. They had another fourth down. The play they went for, and then the they went for fourth down again here. Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good answer there by mm. by Wazoo. Let's see, where are we at here? Are we close to 100? We're down to four measly subs. Hey, we made it! Yeah. 50 101! Woohoo! Thank you guys! And it's Bo Boba Shake. Thanks for subscribing. All right, so we've hit another milestone to break the 5100 mark to get to 5101. Thank you guys, I appreciate that. And I'm sure tomorrow during the game at Lumen we'll probably get a few Alina. more. Woohoo! Alina's there. How do you feel, Alina? One day after your birthday. Mm -hmm. What a game! 24, 21. Boy, at this rate. I wonder how many people are rooting for the Huskies or for the Cougars. Yeah, let's put a let's put a uh, I'm gonna put a poll out there. Let's mm -hmm. do a poll. Um, we'll ask. I'm gonna ask you who you think is gonna win, but I'm instead I'm gonna ask which team are you rooting for? Yeah, uh, Huskies or. Cougars. Let's see what people say. So I'm going to post the poll in the chat. You can answer it now whenever you get a chance to. Um, I just I don't, I don't know the people who are actively chatting and watching. How many Huskies fans versus how many Cougars fans we have? And we'll keep an eye on that poll and see what uh, it turns out. It's pretty. Uh, I'd say it feels like it's more slightly more Washington fans, but well, you never know. So answer. I should answer my own poll here myself. I'm a I'm a Husky. Oh, I don't think I can vote on my own poll. Actually, <laughs> so you, <laughs> out of 25 votes already, that was quick. I just hit the thing. Uh, 25, 31 votes, 71 Huskies, 29 percent Cougars. 
So go ahead and vote away hmm. in the poll. 34 votes in, 74 to 26. Let's see. So, so as I thought, more mostly Huskies, but let's see how it goes. Just seconds into the poll. All right, back to the game. Huskies down again. 40 per, 41 votes in, 73 to 27 Huskies. All right, here we go. Kickoff with 5.07 left in the first half. Again, Huskies will get the ball to start the second half. Boom. Here's the kick. It will be returned from the goal line. 5, 10, 15. Out to, ooh, down at the 17-yard line. Good coverage. Talking about Nakia Watson's mom. He said he was afraid to catch the ball because the ball hit him in the face when he was younger, and his mom just stuck with him and kept working with him. Well, let's see who makes Huskies him Huskies at the 17 yard line, down by three. He's going to play action throw, goes deep. He's got him. Yes, go. Stay up. Oh, down to the 35 yard line. <laughs> 50 yards That's or something like that. Dunze again. You could tell he was going to go deep. Look at him. He had a two steps on the on the uh, defender. No, the guy, the defender didn't, didn't even, didn't even turn around. Yeah. Wow, what a play. 50 yards and then some. Already the uh, Cougar yeah, territory at the 35. Line already. He's going to throw yeah, it. And zips it to the tight it. end at the 27, 28-yard line. Gain of about six. Third down, uh, second down at four. Well, the poll's closing in after 59 votes, 66 to 34. A few more Cougar fans uh, starting to chime in here, mm -hmm. making the vote a little tighter. Second and four, coming up on four minutes left in the first half. Ball at the 29-yard line. Three receivers to the right, one left. Motion, the tight end to the left. Handoff to the running back, and he's going to push ahead. What was that? Number Thought 88. Four yards. He'd be short by one. That was a good move by 88. I just didn't work. Kind of like he went to the left motion. And to, to block. Mm -hmm. That's where the running back is right. going to run. Third and one. Here we go. They're going to probably, they're, they're going to go in there up to oh, the handoff. Boom. He's in for the first down. Oh, he may not know it. No, he got it. He got it. First down, oh, yeah, skis to the 25 yard, 24 yard line. Now he's going to throw now. Now he can do whatever they want to. Most likely they'll throw. Let's oh, throw just a little, or run just a little bit more than the uh, Cougars do, mm -hmm. which doesn't take, take much because so the Cougars are probably going up by five times. 24 yard line. 24. Yeah, 24. Two receivers stacked to the left. Snap. It's going to be a play action fake. Throws back to the left oh, on a screen. Nobody there. First down and dives ahead. I think he had a face mask too. He got his face mask. I didn't see that. 12 yards, 13 yards for a Huskies. First down. First down. Look, watch his face. Watch right here on the tackle. Shh. No, you can't see it from that. It looked like his head got, got pulled back. I thought he did. Got face masked. 12 yard line, first and 10. This, that's where they took barely two minutes to get this down the field. This could be another. Snap, play action, throws, right fade there. route. Oh, oh, a little overthrown. overthrown. Intended for McMillan on the left side. Try to one hand it, but way overthrown. At least he put it where nobody else can get it. It's either your receiver or nobody. Second and 10. Empty backfield now. Three receivers left, two right. Penix waits the shotgun snap. Motion 22 towards the middle. Continues on and 
Penix is going to throw to the tight end up the middle to the four yard line. And it's going to be third and two from the four. What do you think? Run or throw here? Approaching two minutes left. I always forget that there's no two minute warning in college. I'm expecting for the clock to stop at two. There is no two minute warning. I'll probably give it to you. Think? Gonna I run think he's gonna hand it off. Throw? No, actually, I think it's a throw. He walks up to the lines, barking orders. Crowd is loud. Running back shifts to the left, right, back to the left. Snap, and he's gonna keep it. <laughs> Keeper touchdown. That was a good fake. Good fake. I was faked that was out. A good fake. It's the second rushing touchdown for Michael Penix. He, the guy, fake, he was a read option, faked it to the running back and got buried in the backfield. Back the wrong guy. I mean, if it was handed off, he was the <laughs> second time. To, that would have been uh, buried for a loss, but he kept it and he went to the un, in the end zone untouched. So they get back to lead with a buck forty left on the clock. They're going to try to make it a four point lead with this extra point. Snap, hold, kick, and it is good. 28-24. This is the score I predicted for tomorrow's game for the Seahawks. I said Seahawks 28-24, but boy, this game. Oh, see that? Yeah. That's not what I expected. I thought it was going to be... Oof. I thought it was going to be a handoff. I didn't expect him to keep it. Wow. That drive went fast. It took, it took Still one, about two one minutes minute left. 40 seconds to, to the half. Oh. Hurst, Katie, the Go Dogs. My husband and son are at the game, and I can't imagine how wild it must be there. I hear it's insane. Yeah, I don't think the TV broadcast does it justice. Can't really hear how loud the crowd is, but from from the way that they're struggling to get their play calls in, it's got to be really loud. Megan says this is way closer than I thought. Norb, well, mm -hmm. you know, it was only a three point, a two and a half point difference in terms of the odds. So I guess I'm not that surprised. I had a feeling. It's kind of like what I'm feeling about tomorrow's game. I feel like the Raider game tomorrow with Seattle is going to be like this kind of tight and uncomfortable and feeling like, okay, whoever makes a mistake first is going to be the team that loses. Devontae Adams is mm -hmm. with the Raiders. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a fair catch caught by the Cougars. With a minute 40, can they get down the field and score with a minute and 40 seconds left? They still have all their timeouts. Oh, no, I think they called one. They called one timeout, didn't they? Yeah, I'm not sure how many timeouts they have. Yes, sir. One minute. It's a run. Oh, gets about five, maybe four. Clock runs at 1.30. Two timeouts left for Wazoo, one for Washington. 27. Ball the 29-yard line. Snap. He's going to throw. Looks, 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 looks. Gets it out to the running back on the right flat. Push out of bounds at the 31-yard line. It'll be third down and four with minute 17 left. They haven't sacked the quarterback yet. They've barely touched. Well, no, they've fast. touched the quarterback, but he's managed to scamper away every time. He almost got hit from behind. You see that guy yeah, like, coming, coming at the last second. Shoop. That should have been a... Flag. Uh, no, no. I mean, uh, the 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 blitzer almost caught I mean, up to him. He, he got oh, hit him. I don't know if he hit him. I don't know if that was allowed. Throws slot slant complete. Oh, they said I'm actually five minutes behind the game. I'll have to try to catch up at the One half. Minute eleven. I've got my DVRs behind. Snap, gonna throw again. Looking, 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 looking. Swings it to the running back way back in the flat. He's gonna be taken down, forced out of bounds. Uh oh. I think a face mask. He had a face mask. 
Yeesh. Was it face mask? It was weird. He was tackling like a pie. I know. He must have grabbed his face mask. Jeez, you had him for a negative wow, play, and instead it's a 15-yard penalty and a first down, right? Let's see. Right. Oh. oh, yeah, the left hand. Guy held on to it for like two seconds. Oh, yeah. And the referee was right there. I think in all the, in all the I was, days I, I played his little right league hand. football, I never touched, grabbed the face mask. That was pretty obvious. So that puts it into the Washington territory at the 43. He's almost in field goal range. He's going to throw. Looking, looking, looking. Shovel pass. My gosh. That was a seven-yard shovel pass. He just pushed it forward. That was yeah, dangerous. Just... That ball was like floating out there, but he gets it for a gain of about five to the 37-yard line. Uh, 40, 42 seconds there. left. Snap. He's looking. He's going to look again. Looks left. Looks right. Looks back again. Under pressure. Breaks the tackle. Goes back to the middle of the field. Throws to the right sideline and heaves it out of bounds. Throws it away. 30 seconds left. 30 third and seconds. four. Jeez. He is like Russell Wilson yeah. 2013 version. I got to hear. It reminds me more of the uh, Kansas City Chief. Oh, Patrick Mahomes? Mm -hmm. the way yeah, he does his shovel pass. No, that's true. He does a lot of shovel passes. Yeah. That's true. So at the forty, what that thirty-nine 30s, yard line? It's about the thirty-seven. Washington State, it's thirty seconds to go. Snap, handoff. I don't know. He ran, and he gets the first down. Sheesh. They, they should call a timeout here. Oh, it's a flag too. I think that's on us. That looks like the Wazoo guy is pointing at the UW player, and all of a sudden, it's like, look what he's doing. And then all of a sudden, the flag got no thrown. Flag. No, there is a flag, though. Unless yeah, they no, pick it he, up. He could say that there was There's no penalty on the play. Yeah. Oh. Uh oh there is a flag. Oh, my gosh. It is on Huskies. 15 yards. So that's going to put it inside the red zone. Let's see what happens. Oh, right there. Wow. Oh, oh that was he got, a mistake. Because he got pushed from behind, yeah. and then he swung at him. Yeah. That could be an ejection if you... But he did get caught when he, the guy pushed him. 18-yard line inside the red zone now, so 25 seconds left. So time is kind of key here, but they still got two timeouts, so not really. Not they the way can these guys easily flip that. Snap. Blitz, they pick it up. Pressure comes, throws deep right side, way out of bounds. Throws it away. 19 seconds left. No penalties? 19 seconds left. Second and 10. Andy wants to know, have you ever done the ice bucket challenge? I did. That's a long time ago, feels like. That's a 21 yard line or 19 yard line. Second and 10, 19 seconds to go. Let's see what happens. It's going to hand off. Oh, man, big hole. Wrap him up. First down to the seven yard line. Wow. 12 seconds left. Timeout called with 11 seconds left, so it's it's not automatic yet here because with only 11 seconds and one timeout, they got to save one just in case they have to go for the field goal. But they're going to obviously try to put it in the end zone here. Is that Watson? Uh, I think so. Yep, Watson's a he's a good runner. Yep, makes the most of the few opportunities that he gets. But this 12 guy, seconds uh, left. They put a second back on the clock. That's a big difference, 12 seconds. One extra tick. This uh, So one timeout. Cougar quarterback could just flip that thing. It's so close. Well, let's see. This is... Uh, 12 seconds. Let's see. Now, if they can get a sack here or get a hit yeah. from, you know, uh, every time that they don't get in the end zone. They haven't precious time this guy yet. That's the thing. He's hard to bring down. So if you're if you're the Cougars, you probably want to throw this thing because you don't want to risk, you know, 
a tackle short of the of the end zone. Here you go. He's going to roll right. He's going to throw. Looking, looking, looking. Throws. Ooh, yeah. almost intercepted. That's right. Thrown down in the ground. Seven okay. seconds left. So you remember, they got they don't want to not come away with points. So they got to have at least three they seconds might call left. Call a timeout now and kick well, the field goal. Mm, well, the clock stops. The clock stops with the in, in, incomplete pass. So they'll run one more play. Something. Yeah. The one thing they can't afford Seven is to get sacked. Seven seconds is too risky. You know? If they get sacked, that would be potentially a drive killer here. They'll make it something quick. He's going to go right for the end zone to throw it away. Whatever it is, it can't <laughs> take long. Here we go. This is a crucial play right here. This is it. The clock could run out here. Play clock should run out. Time to delay the game. Delay the game. What? They ran out of time. That's going to move it back to the 13-yard line. That's a huge... That changes everything. Instead of 7 yards, now you got to go 12 or 13. All right, here we go. They have three receivers left, one right. Single setback to his left. Ward takes a shotgun snap. He looks, throws quickly, Faper out to the right. There was a lot of contact there. No penalty? Gosh, he was grabbing him the whole yeah, way down. Grabbing. I thought that was going to be pass interference. Yeah. Now they probably got to kick the field goal. Look at that. It's a growl. He got away with some hand grabbing there. So now you got to go. It's the last play. If if you go for it, no, they got to kick the field goal. Okay, wow. So Huskies actually. So no matter what. Unless they run a fake, it uh, could be a one-point game here if they make this kick. This could be a off the left hash, an uh, angle here. Snap, hold, kick. That looks good. It is. So with no time left, we're at the half. It's 28-27, UW by one. So wow. they at least limited it the first time to not getting a uh, touchdown here. <laughs> You know, a good game. Bad. This is not too bad. This is a very entertaining game. It is game. a good game, yeah. It's mostly know. offense, but pretty good defense there to keep him out of the end zone. So, not bad. Well, 68% are uh, really for so the Huskies. 100 votes. The poll says 68%. I mean, 68 of you are Husky fans and 32 of you, almost a 2 to 1 ratio, are Cougars fans. So, Uh, somebody in the in the chat was just talking about this USC game right here. USC won this game, I hear. Look at him get away. Whoa, look at him go. Yeesh. Somebody talked about this. All oh, right, there. Megan said, I'm grinning after a huge USC win over... Notre Dame, so maybe that has colored my view. I think that was in regards to this game being closer than she thought it was going to be. Make, you gents are rocking the purple. Yep, I don't think we've ever <laughs> worn quite so much purple in one time before. Not from a word from our sponsors. Oh, look, look, this is the, the, the Husky game. This is the last, or the Oregon game. Oregon's last chance to win it. And he couldn't haul in the touchdown pass. And they lost by four points. Oh, look at that hurdle move. Wow. So Utah, that's why, because Utah destroyed Colorado. So look, USC is already clinching birth. Oregon clinches if if UW loses. Mm -hmm. If you if we win, Utah clinches because they win the tie three way tiebreaker with Oregon and us. So Utah would basically leapfrog but the rest. Washington of them. would not? It doesn't seem like there's a scenario where UW would make it to the Championship? Championship. And what? It, it seems like it's either Utah or Oregon. Wow. So I don't know how that, why that is, but 
for, I don't know if it's because of who we lost to or what, but... Oh, okay, Utah was our only loss for USC. Oh, Did that's the USC. Utah uh, beat Washington? We didn't play them. Maybe. I don't think. So... All right, I'm going to take a moment here. You know, they use the little boys' room. I'll be right back. <clears throat> well, it's half time right now. And uh, Washington is leading only by one point. 28-27. Oh, boy. All those who are rooting for Washington, they're getting, I don't know, maybe scared, concerned, worried. But let's see. It's another 30 minutes of football. So... Yep. Utah beat Arizona State, and we lost to them, so we did lose. Oh, Megan is in Australia? She says, I may live in Australia, but my heart is in Seattle, so go Huskies. And tomorrow you're going to say, uh, Megan, you're going to say, go Seahawks. Right? <laughs> uh, a frequent Husky fan is saying, hopefully we can pull this one out. Yep. <coughs> and uh, KK, Alina right now, I'm at Skagit Valley College. I'm curious where people are from here. So Megan was here from Australia, right? I think Megan's That's from Australia. Uh, Megan. That's uh, Megan Gout Kruger. But he says, uh, Oh, she visited Seattle after a month in Seattle, and that included seeing the Hawks live at Lumen. Wow. Oh, here, Tyler Patcher's back. Oh, yep. Whatever you're asking. Hey, I'll Tyler, join Tyler's if we can here. chat. Oh. All right. Well, I see AD is also in the uh, uh, Discord as well. Oh, and then who's the guy out there, Norm? Bring this down. No. All right. So while you guys are chatting, um, yeah, let us know where you're watching the game from. Let's take a uh, quick sample of your viewing location, city and state or city and country. And in the meantime, we'll open up the Discord. So if you guys want to join the Discord, again, the link is pinned at the top. And let's see if we can... Get a few Discord conversations going here. Let me see. Yo, yo, Adrian. We, from Seattle. Kathleen from Prosser. Akshay from Tequila. Oruror from California. And Megan is, of course, Megan in from Australia. New South Wales, Australia. Can you hear me? Right. AD. Is in the Discord chat. What's happening, man? Hey, buddy. Hey, check this out. I see that you look like you're working on a script there. Mm -hmm. you're working on your writing? Yep. All right. Good for you, man. I see you working on using the uh, final draft program, the, the industry standard for script writing. Hey, John De La Rosa is rooting for the Raiders. Uh oh. Dun, dun, uh -oh. <laughs> There's always somebody out there. Yep. Yep. So, how's your writing going there, AD? Um, right now, I'm on 
episode one. I have so far seventy three pages on this episode. So were you able to take everything that you wrote from your previous stuff and just migrated it over? Is that kind of what you're doing? Or are you kind of starting? Yeah. So yeah, so you're using some of your previous material to figure things yeah. out. What, what I made, what I managed to do was to copy and paste the whole thing on the script writing app I used to have on my phone. Put it on Google Docs. Go to Google ah. Docs. Mm -hmm. Copy and paste the whole, not the whole thing, really, um, a portion of it onto my first episode and mm -hmm. there's that nice no that's good yeah. what was the uh script about it is it, about um kind of a crime thriller right would you say it's a i call it a christian action mystery show hmm. it involves some degree of human trafficking and things like that yep. so yep all right there we go well that sounds like Here's tyler on. parcher in the house oh hey tyler how you doing dude hey so you're watching the game with family is that right yep so whose house are you watching the game at grandpa's house Grandpa, is it different from your grandma's house, or is that the same grandma as grandpa? Same, same grandpa, yeah. Ah. Girl, where is this? Marysville. Uh, no, no, I'm I'm oh. out, up on Alabama Hill. That's my uh, that's my grandma Loggy. The other one's Grandma Parcher, but oh. Grandpa Parcher, actually. Okay, wrong grandparents. Okay, gotcha. Yep. Nice, nice, nice. Hey, Pretty Dad, uh, yeah. yeah, and you're you guys are rooting for the Huskies, right? Yep. I, I don't know about, I don't know about yeah. AD. Yeah. Um, as of right now, I'm writing my script on my computer. Oh, nice. Here, have a look. Um, it's, oh. Linus, is, oh, uh, my great aunt tried to send me home oh, with some are. Vegemite. There we go. Nope, I'm a Bovril girl, LOL. I've never tried oh, wow. Vegemite. Have you ever had tried Vegemite, Dad? Did, did, uh, uh, Auntie Miles ever bring some Vegemite? Because he's from Australia too. From your yeah, radio show, uh, I can't say I've ever tried it. I've only heard about it, but never actually tasted Vegemite. I'm not even sure if I know what Vegemite is. <laughs> Vegemite. I, first time I heard of Vegemite, it was from a song from Men at Work, huh. and they talked about <clears throat> a Vegemite sandwich, hmm. and. Uh, I don't know what that is. <laughs> what is Vegemite? Tell, somebody tell, yeah, tell us what is Vegemite. That, I'm sure. Although he doesn't, she doesn't like Vegemite. She doesn't like Vegemite. She say what now? A Voril? I don't know hey, what Bo uh, Voril is. Until half comes over. Oh, uh, probably another five minutes or so. Something like that. Well, while it's still half time, you should show your dad the video that you did for me. I d oh, I Oh, the other one. Did you see? Uh, did you see Tyler's no, video? Uh, let's see. It's my birthday video. What? When was your birthday? No, that was what two weeks, two weeks ago? ago. I was trying let's to get see. Miles to play it, but she already has her oh, music set up. Right. Yeah. Normally, Miles has already a, a preset thing. It's kind of hard to change. It. And I've, I try to throw some last second things with her too, but sometimes it's uh, mm. she's got a all things figured out. Let's see what I have here. Oh, we've got super Ooh, chat from Jeremy, Jeremy What's G. Chrysostomo 2.0 is back to troll you. LOL. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 2.0 is only 1.0 right mm -hmm. here. Um, let's see here. Oh, not in there. I'm going to track it down. Um, Vegemite is a veggie spread. What does it taste like? What, what, what's the, uh, how would you describe Vegemite? If you had to explain it to somebody like us who's never had it before, what does it taste like? What's the equivalent of Vegemite? 
Let's see here. On camera. Hey, no, babe, I'm muted. Nope, I still hear you. Oh, okay. All right, here's the. Uh... Turn your camera on. <laughs> you talking to me? The camera gets kicked off. Oh, uh, Norbs. Oh. There and we go. And there it goes. Okay, let's see. So this is the. Oh, Megan says very salty. Don't need much. Not sure what you guys have. <clears throat> that's the same. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Salty vegetable <laughs> spread. Hmm. Not, not, it's hard to compare. All right. So this is this is the music video for that I did for Tyler last week. Hmm. Here it is. Oh, we got to take it from the Four, three, two, one. All right, stop what you're doing, because I'm introducing my number one fan of social media. His first name's Tyler, last name's Parcher. He's going to tell you what's for dinner. With headphones on, he takes those walks, and then he'll hang out with his grandma. Don't matter what time or what is happening, you know we'll always ask for Madden. Yeah, today's his birthday, but yo, I ain't singing, because singing happy birthdays hit that even. Don't ask me why, he's that kind of guy. Oh yeah, he don't like fireworks neither. So here's an engine startup to warm your heart up. And a birthday wish, Mr. Tyler. Because when it comes to loyalty, he's Norm Cam royalty. I must say, bro, I appreciate you. It's your birthday dance is your chance to do the bump. Tyler, do the birthday bump. Uh, do the birthday bump. Come on, man. Yeah. Do the... Do the birthday bump, do, uh, do the birthday bump, yeah, with your grandma. I uh, do the birthday bump, I uh, uh, do the birthday bump, I eh, eh. uh, do the birthday bump, I eh, uh, do the birthday bump, I. Eh. Happy birthday, Tyler. Now let's play some Madden. Psych. <laughs> Just kidding. Maybe later. E. There you go. That was, <laughs> that was the birthday uh, bump, Tyler Parcher rap. Yeah, that's pretty hey, good. You should show your dad um, my part in your uh, music video. <laughs> it's the all request hour. Well, let's see. Well, let me see if I can pull up that song. <laughs> Actually, it is the game for tomorrow. So this is kind of like my last chance to play the music video. Of no, right, here we go. My soda. Let's see. Oops. It's not quite there. Nope. All right. I got to figure what out that, that video. It was a video that wasn't what I thought it was going to be. So I got to <laughs> pull that up. Let's Did see. Did you guys go to the game tomorrow here. with you? Oh, yeah. Yep. We're going to be riding together for the first time in over a month, I think. Yeah, more than a month. This is the watch band I have for my Apple Watch, this one. Like the okay. silicone ones. Okay, here we go. Here is a video. Here we go, hey, Andrew D. Andrew. All right, so this was the previous one. This is the one for the Raiders game. Sorry, I don't really see this working out. That game is just the end of the year. But the Raiders are better now. I thought we'd lose this game. They don't have Renfro or Warriors. I remember that game. Yeah, well, that was the future of Seattle. No, Brian Bosworth. There you go. Oops, sneak peek to next week, the week after. So there you go. That was the little Raiders preview. So at that time, I thought we were going to lose that game. I thought the Raiders were going to be way better than that. But injuries have been bad for the Raiders. They lost Hunter Renfro, one of their key receivers. They lost Waller, their tight end. So they've mm. been short on playmakers. So that's why they had kind of a, so far, so far a lackluster start. They have the same record as the Broncos, who are doing oh. terrible too, 3-7. and seven. Which I don't mind. I thought Tyler said that he was in a music video. I, I misunderstood no, that. Oh no no! Uh, Ad was in the music video. 
You already played mine. But Tyler, it was Tyler had some photos in his video. Oh. Yeah, you got some there off of go. iTunes, uh, <clears throat> Facebook or something. Okay. Yeah, there you go. Well done. That's awesome. Well, you know what? I might be able to just sneak in. If I have to fix, I could post edit the uh, the Alina video. While we're at it, let's just play the the other uh, video. Can you guys stay on for camera Alina. for this one? Are we what? Stay on camera during this the video. Try to. Oh, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep things open, but uh, you know, we'll do our usual thing where we kind of uh, pop in and out for. You can hear background. Breaks. That's my family out there talking. <laughs> All right, here we're we talking go. about the game and stuff. Why not? Let's play. Let's play Alina's video. I'm sure we'll be okay. Not. Nor, but I also got later. this. The keys to the the Subaru. Oh, nice. Along with my Apple AirTag on it. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at Alina's birthday video from yesterday. Let's see if this works. Remind me of that song, Serena. Oh, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> I almost used that song. Yeah. And yeah. there's Alina. She's still here moderating away. She says, oh, I know. Thanks, and look, she's. When are you going to jump on the Discord? I didn't Alina? realize we that Alina to get you on has, camera, but... has been a world traveler. Oh. She has been to England. She's been to Australia. Huh? That's bad. Right. I don't know. Mm. Maybe one of these times she'll I'm pop on the Discord. For the Christmas Eve game. For the Seahawks. Christmas Eve is going to be a game against the Chiefs in Kansas City. That was That's a good video. Happy birthday again, Alina. You yeah. deserve hey, well, I'm wearing a, one of these sweatshirts, too. Yep. See Tyler over there wearing his uh, Washington Huskies sweatshirt, like almost oh. similar to yours. Almost. Slightly different lettering on there. That's good. Yeah. I'm sure we got a lot of people wearing purple tonight. Yep. Again, yeah, in our poll, 166 beat, votes, 67% Husky fans, 33% Cougars fans. Almost back to the game here, getting close to the end of half halftime. Yeah, I Let's guess. Let's see, where are we with this uh, with the subs? 105. Okay, a couple more have joined I in. I appreciate you, like you guys. Before the game tomorrow, Norb, like maybe to simulate uh, the Raiders. No, no. We got to hit. We head out. We no time I, tomorrow. I got to do my face paint, and then my mm -hmm. dad comes over about ten. Then we hit the road well, by ten fifteen. Uh, Tyler 10, play uh, Madden too. Oh, he's uh, he I plays do. he plays some now. He's got new Are Xbox. Are you pretty good? Oh, here we go. I do have the Xbox. Yes. All right, back to the game, guys. We'll check right. back in with you. Here's the right, kickoff. Second half. Like Let's go. Boom. And it's going to be Huskies to receive. He lets it go into the end zone touchback. So here we go. As I said, Huskies with a one-point lead, 28-27. And with the ball to try to, to build on that lead. Here's that double move touchdown. There's the fake. See what they have this time. John So, thanks for thanks for subscribing. Mm -hmm. 
Here you go. He's going to throw. Throws deep, middle of the field. He's got him. To the McMillan, 30, 25, 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown! Woo! Oh my goodness, the first play of the second half touchdown! is a touchdown oh! for the Huskies! Got the He's got his I told you correct. he was going to go deep on a, yeah. at least one or two times. First play, 10 seconds in, and they score an opening touchdown. People aren't even back from the bathroom yet and at uh, Pullman. Oh, look at that, wide See, open. If- in the first uh, period, he Ooh. has been overthrowing right. everybody. He's dialed in. Like he's oh, got his man. Range. Scoreboard's not up to date yet, but it's 34-27. About to be 35-27. Kick is up, and the kick is good. And just like that, barely a breath taken. And they are on and top with a quick only? touchdown. Hmm? 50 seconds? Not only? even. It was 10 seconds. Oh, they had Look at one that. play. Ten seconds. That was something else. Man, the yardage in this game. Woo! That's <coughs> insane. Panics. How many yards already does he have? That was 75 yards or 80 yards. 75 yards? Oh, I forgot to see if I could speed this game up a little bit. I'll try to do it at the break because, let me see. That, they were so shocked, all right. Oh, actually, I am way behind. Huh? All right, I need to... Sorry, I got to catch my live stream up for my broadcast. Try to get up to speed here. Somebody said I was like a few minutes behind, but well, maybe not. No, I think I was live. It's live. There we go. All right, kickoff. 35-27, eight-point lead. Wow. Ten seconds in, and they score one play, one touchdown. But Wazoo has shown that they have no problem responding themselves with quick strikes of their own, so... Mostly the uh, elusiveness of quarterback Cameron Ward just getting out of the pocket and not getting sacked. There you go. He's going to th- swing it out to the running back on the left side. Boom, breaks the tackle, but I think he's hit immediately. Ball comes out, but he's already down. So it's a three-yard gain for Watson. He's slow to get up. Uh Uh-oh, he's slow to get up. The running back Uh is slow to get up after a hard hit. Ooh, he's got a right leg slightly banged up there. So he steps out. Second down is seven. Snap. And it's a handoff, left side. Bounces outside. He's going to get the first down. He's quick, 40, 45, and knocked out of bounds at the 47-yard line. First down. Jeez, that guy's quick. Yeah. That's fast little sucker. That's the uh, replacement of Watson. Watson's huh? backup, yeah. Jenkins. First down at the S- Cougar 47. Only a minute into this second half. Snap. He's going to hand off again. Oh, this time he's buried in the backfield for a loss of about five, six, seven yards. He couldn't get away that time. Oh, look at him from the linebacker position. Takes him down way back behind the line of scrimmage. Second and 18, a loss of eight on the play. He's going to throw. Under pressure, dumps it to the running back. And they bury him for another loss. This time he loses two on the swing pass. Three third down and 20. They're going the wrong direction here on this drive. So it's third down. But now. don't count out Wazoo. They found ways to <laughs> fake they punts, fourth down. But this is a big down right here, third and 20. Third I want to see Huskies uh, kind of get the quarterback. I know. They're just so close. But these are very yeah. slippery. They have three down linemen. Everybody else is in coverage. Three receivers on the left, one to the right. 
Got their nickel package, two linebackers, three DBs and two safeties. One, D, uh, one running back in the backfield snap. They blitz the linebackers. Will they get there? No. Yes, they He's still getting away. Finally, a sack. <laughs> Finally, they yeah. take him down for a loss of one. one. Woo! You're just, well, you got down. what you wanted. That's fourth down. <laughs> wow, finally, a, a, a fourth down punting situation. We haven't seen and no this. Flag, no, no right. flag. Right. But look how many missed tackles. Look There's at still, that. like, three guys missed him before they finally took him he, down. He's kind of slippery. So they blitzed like the it. linebackers. They kind of took a chance there yeah. and, and uh, caused so the manufacturing So let's see if they have pressure. any trick play here. I don't think oh, they can I don't see. Now they got a guy, every, a man on a man covered this time. So, ooh, almost got a guy there. Short kick. Fair catch at the 26-yard line. Ooh, so. I, that scares me sometimes. What happens if he, he dro drops it? That big trouble. So and it now. It's happened many times. Mm hmm. All right, so that's the first, I'm going to say mistake, but first uh, yep. failure first to score I mean, in a while. Not able so. to get nothing. Now, if UW can strike again, they could get a two-point or a two-score lead here, and that would be huge in a game where yep. it's been back and forth, back and forth all day. This way it's going to get interesting. Yeah. Let's see if they could get the score here. You almost don't want him to score too fast because it's so fast that no time gets off the clock. But, heck, if you get the touchdown, why not? Let's see. Where's our sub count here? Oh, I lost one. Where'd you go? Let's try to get to 110 here. We were at 105 just a second ago. Somebody jumped ship. <clears throat> can you? Hmm? Can oh, you yeah, you, oh, yeah. People can unsubscribe. You can? Yeah, you, you can subscribe and then you can unsubscribe. So it can go down as well. So people do that for various reasons, whether it's on Facebook or Instagram or whatever. So there you go. I'm going to end the poll. 187 votes, 66 Huskies, 34 Cougars. I think we have a pretty good idea of the... the uh, um, the, the makeup of our crowd tonight. Mostly Husky fans, as I kind of figured. JSD Norb is asking, does Norb read these messages? Of course he does. Well, I try to. We don't read all, we don't get, we don't read all of them, but we try to read some of them. Um, and he says, I subbed Norb? What does that mean? That means he's a sub subscribed. Oh, okay. Who asked, who said that? Who said that? JSD is asking, does Norb read these messages? Yeah, so I, I do try to. Uh, 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 um. Megan, why, is it, why would anyone want to unsubscribe from your quality content? Or <laughs> Probably a Raider fan who jumped ship. Allegiant says, my LED light strip by Govi is on the purple color. Nice. Alexander, I wonder if we should draft quarterback Penix in the future. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, uh, it's a big difference, though, from quarterbacks in college to quarterbacks in the, in, the, yeah. uh, in the pros, right? We see a lot of great quarterbacks who don't even get looked at. In, That's right. In, you know, only the really, really good ones. And even some of those don't turn out to be so good, right? There's been a couple of busts in the, in the NFL. JSD loves the streams. Orb, keep it up. Meg and the Harden hit, freaking brilliant and such sweet payback. Oh yeah, that's one of the favorite plays of Steve Largent getting payback on James Harden with that hit fumble recovery. Okay, here we go. Back to the game. 35-27, an eight-point lead, and the Huskies with the football back at their own 26-yard line. Takes the shotgun snap. He's going to play action, roll left and throw. Throws, complete, splits the defenders to the 45, 50 to the 48-yard line and out of bounds on the near sideline. Good for another Seahawks. First, first down. down. Now they're you know, he has been perfect so far. Yeah, completely opposite half. from the first quarter where he was missing most of his yeah, targets. He missed a lot. Okay, where are we now? 
49 yard line. Into Wazoo territory, quick on one play, 48 yard line. Motion, running back to the First right. And makes the throw, swings it to the running back of the 50. Makes a move, 45. Hits at the 42, and whoa, they're saying the ball came out. And they do! Wazoo stripped the football. Uh-oh. Remember we talked about the mistake? Yeah. That might have been the first big mistake by the Huskies. A turnover at the 42-yard line. Man, they must have stripped it because it didn't come out. Now, was he down? Oh, the ball did come out. Well, it's hard to tell when the ball came out on that angle. They got to review it, of course. Here we go. No, oh, he's down. I don't know. It, it might because he was kind of he's in the down. air when he got hit, and the ball. If the ball came out before he was, if the ball was already out before he touched the ground, that would be Wazoo football. I think it's down. That's what I would say. Look, watch him. He gets hit. He's still Ball's there. in there and, and right man. there. No. No. Ooh, it's going to be close. Yeah. It's hard to down. tell when the ball actually got jarred loose. What do you think? You say he, he fumbled, and I say no, he didn't. Oh, it came out. It came out. That view actually showed it. It came out early. Ah, that's a big one. Just when they had a chance to take a two score look lead. At the line judge. I think they're gonna I think they're gonna hold the play will stand. What do you think? I think it's a fumble. Okay. Don't want it to be, but I think it is. That other that last view really showed it. He was he was falling back we did and then he got hit. in front. We didn't see that. Hmm. Well, that's a huge. We have to look at it. Here we go. Play ruling calls. Yep. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, I wasn't sure about the other angles, but that last one really showed it because he was in the air when the ball got knocked out. Yikes! So now that makes up for their. Hunt stop that they had, and now it's back to where they were. Well, let's see what happens. So one play negates the other, and now we're back to Wazoo with the ball. He was going to throw. Throw is complete to the 47. Oh, knocked down to the 50. Gain of seven. The flag. Yeah, he held. Like, what's kind of hanging foot. on? That was kind of weird. Taking it. Whoa! Oh, balls wow. out. He snapped it. He wasn't ready for it. It's a loss. That'll be a loss of four or five. They're down. He snapped it too quick. Oh. He's lucky he got that back. That would have been another turnover right back to UW, but he jumped on it. So it's, it's a third and five at their own 47-yard line. 40, yeah, 47-yard line. See if they can stop him again. That would be huge if they can get a stop here. Mm -hmm. Ward's going to try to throw. Ten Seven, minutes six, left in the first five, third quarter. Four. Snap. He's going to throw. Looking. Throws left side. No, too high. We got it. I thought it was too. I thought it was overthrown. Like he said, called it these in. These guys could jump, and that's that kid who got the call against him when he didn't pull it in at the two-yard line. This time he threw it. I thought it was too high, but he looked it in and made a nice catch. Hmm. I thought it was overthrown. Gets the first down. <laughs> Nine forty left. This is a fast. All of a sudden, I feel like the third quarter is just now. At the now. 30 Five yard line. Four yard line of UW. Snap, handoff, bounces. Oh, that's oh. a mistake. And he loses two. Tried to bounce it outside, and that was cause of negative yardage. Should 
Snap. Hand off. Nope. Play action. He's going to throw. Throws it complete to the tight end, to the 30, 25, out of bounds. He didn't get. Short of the first down. Short, short. Going to be one yard short. I expect they're going to go for it anyway. And they go with that hurry up. A couple of substitutions here. Oh, Watson's back in the game. Oh. Uh-oh, God, these guys are really uh, more running off the field. But the refs give them a chance to substitute. See if they go quick snap. Will they run? Will they pass? It's going to be a pass. Screens, bubble screen, complete. First down, 20-yard line. Going down at the 12-yard line. Man, oh, man. Boy, nice block. Knocked him on his buns, but he is actually still able to chirp him up a little bit. Yep. So, first Man. down. How these fumbles, right. turnovers just kill you. At the 12 or 13 yard 13. line. Let's. We need another. We need our own turnover here. It's going to throw. Quarterback draw on his feet to the 10. Tackled there after about a two yard game. Made it to the 11. He was almost tackled, but he got so away from the slippery. first one. He never gets the. He never goes down after the first guy. Actually, I'm surprised he got down there. This guy is so strong. Second and eight, quick snap. He's gonna throw complete to the nine. Good tackle. Limbs it to a two, maybe three yard gain. On the eight yard line. Yep, third down and third and third down five. I guess they don't have to score yet, technically. Third and five. First down if they got to the three yard line. Well, let's see. 723. This game's suddenly going fast now. It's like a roller coaster. Whee! I think it's going to go around this. Who? Number one is going to run this. going to keep it? Yeah. So UW substitutes. Trips left. Empty backfield. Uh -oh. He could run. Uh oh. Too oh, no. Too many men on the field. Yeah, that's right. He's gonna. He's still scrambling. Throws complete, but he loses. Actually, gets about two yards. But we're gonna have a penalty anyway, and that's gonna make it probably a first down and goal. We had twelve men on the field. Twelve men. That's too bad because it would have been fourth down and three. Instead, yeah. it's gonna be a first down. Yeah, the penalty. Man. First and goal. You know, Huskers are doing a lot of mistakes. I know. It's, whether it's on offense or defense, it seems like they, it's too slow to get the personnel figured out. And here's a guy running in late in the game any, again. So many All right, that? the sticks show third and one, but it should be first down? Or maybe not. Two, maybe they didn't three, get it. Four, five, six. They're saying seven, third down eight, and one. Nine, ten, eleven. Okay. The ref said half the distance to go of first down, but it's not a first down. So maybe it's third and one here. So this is still kind of a crucial play. Handoff. I got it. And he's a touchdown. Didn't matter for a touchdown. And so Washington State is within a two-point conversion of tying this game because of the fumble. Would they go for two? I'm guessing the way these guys play, they'll go for two. Yep. I don't even think they'll think about it. They're Looks just gonna like go. The offensive line of the Hus gonna stop their run. Yep, they're going for it. Here's a bunch of players coming on late. Three, six, nine, ten, eleven. So they they line up on the right hash mark. They're gonna go to the three left. receivers split far left and one on the right. They could hand this off. Or Ward could run it himself. He's going to pressure. He's got him. Hang on. No, he got oh, away. Oh, oh, he's got he's going to score. Did he get in? No, he didn't get in, they're saying. He didn't get in. They said his ball, the ball didn't cross the, the, the pylon. His knee, his right leg hit the pylon, but I don't think the ball did. He, I don't think he put the ball ahead of the pylon. Dude, look at the ball. No, he didn't. He had it in his left hand. Yeah. He needed to, to reach it across, and he didn't do it. 
Wow, that's a huge stop if they can if they do indeed roll oh, that down. Guy. He got hit. Wow, <laughs> I thought he was going to get in. Didn't it look like he was going to get in easy? He but got that was shoved. this one. Third down. No, no, that was that's the they had the touchdown. That was the two point conversion attempt. Oh, they already had the touchdown, so that was so to tie the game. The so if it's, it's if it's ruled definitely no good, that's good. Then it's going to be a two point game. Good still. for the Huskies. <laughs> yeah. That's the risk of going for it instead of yeah, making a one-point game. It'll be a two-point game. Whew. Wow. Well, at least I still have the lead. That was a relief. Let's see. Hopefully, Brian Roberts says go, go Cooks. And Blizzard Park says. Blizzard Peak. Hopefully, the Huskies win. So. Mario Yossi say, let's go, my Washington State Cougars. Yeah. So, they will kick off, and Huskies will get the ball back again. A chance again to make it a two-score game if they could score on this next drive. These games are so late. If you're on the East Coast, it's no wonder if these guys on the East Coast don't know much about the Huskies because they start play at 7.30. That's 10.30 at the East Coast. Right now, it's almost 10.00. It's one in the morning. <laughs> if, you're, oh, if you're on the East Coast, who's going to watch this game at one in the morning? But you think they would be watching the Huskies? I don't, well, maybe some yeah, of them. Maybe, but you know, most people who got things to get up for, they're, do they going to stay up this late to watch a couple of Washington teams go at it? That's the only disadvantage of being a, uh, a team on the, the West Coast. But then you think about the Hawaii teams. Is, they're, what, five hours ahead? Yeah. Or behind? So That's when they worse. play a game at 7 o'clock, it's already midnight in the East Coast. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, look at Megan says it's 5 p.m. here in Australia. I have to get going. Great to see you and meet your dad. Thanks for hanging out for a little while, Megan. Have some Vegemite on us. Rodarius Brooks, LOL, I'm in Texas. It's after 12. I love West Coast games. Not a lot to watch after a certain time. The formula is on the East Coast, so he's staying up mm -hmm. with us. And look at Kamrudin Modnur. Way to go, dog. It's 2 p.m. here in Malaysia. Oh, uh, watching Malaysia. from Malaysia. Okay, Husky fans and well, well, Malaysia, Malaysia. He's probably got the, holds the record for the farthest... Best viewer so on the say I should put in there. I should ask who is watching uh, and where from the most distant location right now. It's Malaysia from Malaysia. Let's see who anybody else has got. Okay, here's a replay, Dad. Okay. That's a it. pretty good call by the ref to not to see that the ball didn't cross because it was right there. Yeah, he was right there. VWCJPYZQ, thanks for subscribing. All right, here we go. Kick goes. In the end zone, touchback. Two-point lead for the Huskies with 6.30 left in the third quarter. Megan is probably the furthest away. I don't know. The question is, who's, is, is Australia the farthest? Farther than Malaysia? I guess so, huh? I don't really know the distance. I need to see a map. That's true. It's kind of hard to <clears> say. <throat> All right. Pettis the throw. Swings it out to Polk to the 32-yard line for a gain of about seven. Hey, yeah. Megan says 16,000 miles. I should say 1,400 miles to L.A. 
Cruel is 15, say, say no. Well, I think get a 16, shout out. 16,000 would be a lot. <laughs> let's give, uh, let's give Cruel 15 a shout out. 14,000 miles from Seattle? From Seattle? Is that that far? Wow. Blizzard Peak, thanks for the super chat. Hand off. Where is he? Oh, he's got the ball. And it's, that's a gain of about seven or eight. Good for another Husky. Yes. First, First down. down. Blizzard Peak, thank you for the super chat, no, no. Blizzard Peak. Blizzard Peak. Alexander says, I'm only oh, 59 miles yeah, from According to Alina, Australia is the farthest. Is yeah, that right? 16, it's not 16,000, right? It depends on where you 1,600, you're right? That's 16,000. Yeah, it should be farther. <laughs> 16,000, that seems like a lot. I think I'm at 1,600. Unless I'm wrong. Oh, 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 no! Throws to the near side to the running back and it went off his hands. He would have at least a three or four or five yard gain. Instead of it's incomplete. Oh, la papa. Look, it says 16,000. Is it really 16,000, huh? Wow. Okay. You could, you could ask. No, that's Siri, true. Which is farther Let's from see. Seattle? I'll just say. How far is South Wales, Australia from Seattle, Washington? Oh, she's not talking to me. <laughs> didn't understand me. Didn't understand the question. Quick oh, throw, no. the right side. Oh, break it, tackle. Oh, oh, oh ouch! No. That hit. Whoa, oh, that my was gosh. He got face. drilled. That hurt. Ooh. And the helmet, the helmet contact. Boy, he got third drilled. Down. Gained about two for a third down and eight. He got drilled. First, first, the first guy didn't take him down. He kind of had right here. Bam! Yeah. That's a head to head. Isn't that I'm isn't that targeting? Let go of the ball. See? 37, he's woozy after that. Yeah, because he got hit right in the face. Yeah, and then his head hit the turf probably. Look at him, he could barely stand up. That's why I'm, I'm surprised he didn't let go of the ball. Look yeah, at him, he, he, looks, like a, he looks like a boxer. Like, right now. Helmet to helmet. Bam! Um, targeting. It should be, and then his head hit the ground. Targeting. Pow! That's head to head, there's no question. Can't they, can't they challenge that? Oh, really? Huh. I thought you just can't hit a guy with your head. He was not defenseless? Hey, you're right, 1600 is like going to California. You're right, 16... Hmm. Throw it! Throw! Panix throws! Complete the poke to the 37-yard line! Wait, Ooh. not not poke. That was um, Adunze. Wow! When it looked like the pocket was about to collapse on him, he steps up and hits Odunze across the middle yep. for another Husky first, first down, down to the 36-yard line. That was money play right there. That was impressive. Four minutes left in the third quarter. Snap. Panics to throw. He, oh, jeez. Uh -oh, what flag, happened flag. there? Intended for the tight end. He fell down. Luckily, nobody there on the in a crimson no jersey to pick that ball off. Dangerous. You might want to ask Sherry, which is farther, Malaysia or right, Australia from Seattle. Siri, which is further from Seattle, Washington, Malaysia or Australia? Here's what I found. Uh, it's a run for about seven yards. I don't think she'll answer that specific question. I just have to ask specifically, what's the city? All right, here we go. Most people are saying Australia. Australia? Oh, Australia? I think people are saying Australia. New South Wales. Alexa, how far is Seattle, Here's Washington? Seattle is 21. Wow. Car. It's another run to the 12 yard line. Another Husky <laughs> first down. I'll ask, I'll ask her. Alexa, how far is South Wales, Australia 
from Seattle, Washington. New South Wales is 7,934 miles from Fairwood, King County, as the crow flies. 7,000 miles. 7,000 miles. Farther. Okay. Yeah, we'll have to ask what the other one is. Everyone seems to be saying it's Australia. Alexa, how far is Malaysia from Fairwood, Washington? 8,197 miles. What? They're saying it's, it depends on the city, but if that's the case, one said 7,000, the other said 8. Penix, careful now, don't throw a pick. Throws. No! I just said don't throw a pick! Don't throw the pick! No! Picked off in the end zone! I just said don't do it! He did it against uh, Oregon. He did the same thing. It's already third quarter. No, but this is a this is a two score opportunity lead, and you don't need to force the football, bro. Well, oh, overthrown it running, right. Two turnovers. This one the worst. Yeah. Kristen Williams, thank you for the thank you for the super chat. Okay. Um, oh, let's see. Kamurudin, what's uh, what city are you from in Malaysia? Let's get specific here. Alexa, or no? I'm waiting for the answer from from uh, Kamurudin. Oh, Kuala Lumpur. Alexa, how far is Kuala Lumpur from here? Kuala Lumpur is 8,053 miles from Fairwood, King County, as the crow flies. 8,053. Okay, so let's see. Kuala Lumpur is 8,053, right? Miles from Fairwood, Washington. All right. Alexa. How far is New South Wales, Australia from here? New South Wales is 7,934. Wow, barely. By less than... As the crow flies. If this is right, New South Wales is 7,900. So actually, everybody was wrong. It's actually Kuala Lumpur is further away. I never would have guessed that. Hmm. That's a difference of only 153 miles. Mm. Now, now, they, now, depending, maybe where the city could make a difference, but looks like um, that might just Did be it slightly... Did mention Fairwood, Washington on Australia? Well, but I, if, you, if they were listening, they, I used the same location from here as the distance, according to Brady Alexa. is from Cairns. Cairns? Cairns, Australia? Australia. Hmm. Okay. I have a couple people from Australia. I can't believe we threw an interception. Every time we have a chance to jump ahead, we <laughs> give them another comeback opportunity. So I'll put the ball on the 20 yard line because it's a touchdown. Washington 35, the Cougars 33. Hmm. Cairns is in northern Queensland. Is that Car? Karen's, Karen's, Alexa. How far is Karen's, Australia, from here? This might answer your question. Karen's is seven thousand one hundred seventy-one miles from Fairwood, King County, as the crow flies. So it's a little less than New South Wales. Australia is a big continent, so depending on what part of the continent you actually live on, it makes a big difference. So now. Michael Penix is on the phone talking to his quarterback coach or something. Man, what were you doing? You know you can't do that. That's the one thing you can't do. And Wazoo is going to scramble left. He's going to run 20 out of bounds to the 24. Gain him about four yards. Kristen Williams, final score in a super chat says final score prediction for tonight's game and the Hawks game. Ooh, running play knocked down immediately, gained about three. It's me third and two at their own twenty-eight yard line. 
Watson with the carry. Uh, let's see. What's going to be the score of this game? I'm going to say... Oh, yeah, the down Husky. I'm going to say... 24-17. For tomorrow? I'm 28-24 for, for tomorrow. For tonight? It's always hard when you're already in the middle of the game. But I'm going to say we're going to get... 49 to... 40 40 no 45 49 45 that'll be my score 100th like. Cool. All right, here we go. They're third and three. Let's see, they got three receivers in a bunch formation. They're going to throw. He's looking. Pressure! Oh. But he escapes. He's going to go down after a gain of one. It's going to be third down or fourth down and two. Wow, they actually tackle him. <laughs> He's going to go for it. The linebacker did a good job. Well, wait. The quarterback is coming off the field. Are they going to punt? They have to. Well, on this team, you never know when they're going to... Wow, they are going to punt. yard line. Yeah, you know, but you never know. These guys sometimes just go for it. Well, that's a big stop by the D. If they don't get it, then... I know. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I think they, they have to punt. No. Watch the fake. Unless it's a fake Watch again. the fake. Snap, and he will kick. Boom. Sounds like a rugby it style. It is. Takes it at the... 37 yard line, fair catch, and UW that's still, dodges the turnover bullet and gets it back. But that's still a good field position. Not bad, considering that they only kicked from their own 30. So, Megan, I thought Megan had to go. I thought she's still, she's still here. Yoda Soda. Is hanging in here as well. You know, says a Clemson fan. I love I'm rooting for the Huskies. When Megan says, you know, I think we will win, but I'm scared. Yeah, I, I it could be throw. Oh. oh, holding, holding. Defensive. No, it looks like he had one of his arms held back. Incomplete, second and ten, intended for the tight end. Intercepted again. Yeah. And there was this guy right there, mm -hmm. ready to catch it. I think. ETK26 wants to know, are we going to the game tomorrow? Yeah, we're both going to the game tomorrow. Empty backfield, three receivers right, two to the left. Let's see, will they rush four? Probably. They do rush four. Penix rolls to the right, in trouble. No, dodges. Get out of there! Spins away, throws. Incomplete. Short-armed it. Lucky just not to get sacked. 41 seconds into the third quarter. Um, I, the Raiders, I think, are a dangerous team. Man, he grabbed him by his fanny pack. By his arm hand warmers. Okay, Ooh. about the 32-yard right line. Third and 10. Can they get the first down here? 16. Yeah, look for the sign. He walks up to the line, checks protection. Then. And he takes the three, two, one shot, sack on the snap. Blitz! Throw it, throw it, throws it mid end zone. Gee. Oh. Hey, contact. <coughs> yes! <laughs> Defensive pass interference. That'll be an automatic first down. And there's 30 seconds right on. Pass interference. First down, spot of the foul. I'll put it in. Uh, what what yard was that? Twenty Close to 20-yard line. Wow, so they get another first down. 
Well, yeah, there's a lot of contact there. Mm, actually, I don't oh, know. Yeah. I don't know. It's, he didn't really no, he hit was him. riding on him. He was riding. Come oh, on. Oh, actually, no, the ball's put at the, their own 42-yard line. Run play. Oh. He's got a hole. Oh. First down. Oh. Into the Wazoo territory of another Ray Husky. Woo. Uh oh. And that's already a field goal range. Uh, almost. Maybe not quite. First down. 46 yard line of the Cougars. PDX Gaming in the Super Chat. I'll read that right here. What hey, Norm. That? Thanks, thanks for having me on your live side. fan chat a few hours ago. It was a lot of fun. I have to root for you, Dub, since I want Oregon out. Okay. Seven seconds. Come on. Oh, they're going to let the quarter run. They just let the quarter run out. That's it. That's the end of the third quarter. Oh, I see. So after three, still a tight game, 35 to 33, a two-point hey, game Gaming with one more Lord. quarter to go. Thank yeah, I just read chat. that. I just read that Super one. Super chat. And the, the coach on Wazoo is still upset about the, the pass interference call. All right, fourth quarter coming up. Now a word from our sponsor. He says, I want the to win. still listening to you on Discord. Nice. Since Yoda I want says 1230. Oregon out. Right. That's what PDX Cam Gaming saying. Norbert, gotta love that $20 Hawks hot dog. <laughs> well, we usually, if we do get a hot dog, we haven't done it lately because we don't walk outside the stadium anymore. We go straight into the stadium. But I do, actually, I have a $25 uh, stadium gift card for food. We have to use it sometime. Hmm. People are talking about the Raiders and something about Christian being poor Williams, or something. Uh, oh, Kristen Williams lights up the sign with the Super Chat. Kristen says... Possible to be on... A, that's what Christian Williams says. Seahawks might make me play. Huh? It says, uh, Seahawks making playoffs possible Super Bowl? Well, you never Maybe know. Why not? Yoda Sodas. Yoda Sodas says, get Gina Smith that ring. That would be pretty cool. Yeah, that would be nice. We'd have to get past the likes of Philadelphia, the 49ers, the Cowboys, the Phila Vikings. Philadelphia is pretty tough. Yeah, they only have the, what, one loss still? Mm. So. Hey, yeah, I never can tell. You never know. If you get hot, the we right time. We told or expected the Seahawks to be at the bottom. And no matter what, that they're doing better play. than anybody expected. That's what's pretty fun about it. Megan says, we'll make the playoffs to annoy the Broncos and their fans. <laughs> I still don't know too much of the players of the Seahawks, though. Jonathan says, we'll win every game from now on. And We're beating Yoda Kansas sort of City. You put well, you know it'd be Carl amazing if we could beat the 49ers on Thursday. Hmm? Carl? 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 Raleigh at center? Where is that? Oh, Cal Yoda Raleigh. Soda. Yoda oh, Soda Cal Raleigh. Saying. Put Cal Raleigh at center. I'm not familiar with that guy. Is he a good center? No, the guy we have in there now is uh, he's he's doing okay. I don't know if we have to mess with that. It's good to have some depth too, just in case. Megan says, "What picks do we currently have from the Broncos? We have a first, and I think we have a second as well. So again, the worse the Broncos do, the better those two picks turn out to be. And the Broncos play the lowly Carolina Panthers. If they lose to them, boy, somebody's head's gonna roll." in Denver. ETK26, what are your views on Wilson after getting traded? I have to say, well, boy, yeah. I'm sure glad it all worked out the way it has, because we surely didn't see it coming, and 
I'm glad to see it. Fourth quarter action. Penix is going to throw deep middle of the field. No! Oh, yes! <laughs> I didn't even see him. He was in the field. Yeah, yeah, I thought he was intended for McMillan. Oh, I thought he was going to no. get picked. And it was Polk on the on the post pattern, yeah. complete to like the five-yard line, there first and goal. Them. I know. It did seem like that should have been right. Normally, you don't want two players converging like yeah. that. Wow, I thought it was I thought, be intercepted. I thought that the uh, Cougars would enter. Yeah, it could looked like it was, you know, because the camera didn't really show the, the receiver entering the bottom of the frame. You just saw the, like he threw it too far from yeah. McMillan. But they're both going down there. Look at that. Ooh. What a play. Down to the five-yard line. First and goal from the five. So they're kind of getting what they wanted. Boom. Six-yard line. This is what they wanted. Or should have had the last time where they turned the ball over. Now they can make up for it here. Well, they got a Cougar defender down right now, That's being right tended to and walking off the field. 35 33 with a chance to make this a two score game with a touchdown here. Let's see, where are we at with the sub count? I'm going to refresh this in a while. Are we over 110? Hey, 112. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Uh, Yoda, so Chrysos, Chrysosomo, that's <laughs> close. <laughs> Not quite, but you had the right idea. Here we go. It looks like a run formation. And around! Right side, he's going to get in! Touchdown! Touchdown! Huskies! Well, what a nice play. They made it look like they're all bunched up to to yep. uh, run up the middle, and they give it to the receiver around the end. Uh -huh. He goes in almost untouched to make this a 41-33 game with the oh, extra look point at pending. And once again, it's Adunze. This is a good wide receiver, too. It's quick, yeah. So, with this extra point, right now it's an eight-point game, about to make it a nine-point game if he puts this through. Kick, hold. Oh, God, he missed it. He oh, missed no. it. He missed it. So it's an eight-point game. So much for the two-score lead. <laughs> How do you miss from that close? <laughs> he was so good, and you missed this 10-yard, 20-yard <laughs> kick. He could do 50, but not 10. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, that could be big because that's the difference between having to go down and get a touchdown and get the ball back to just one score and you can tie the game. You saw, you saw the video that Monica uh, took of me when I tried to beat the quarterback. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you got I didn't one realize that that ball was kind of heavy. <laughs> <laughs> I was able to do the second net. Yeah. Uh, the first one didn't even reach. <laughs> got threw a little bit harder. Uh -huh. I should have thrown harder. Oh, my goodness. One possession, yeah, Yoda said, it's rigged. One possession game. No, well, who's better last year, Wilson or this year, Gino? Oh, no question, Gino's better this year. Wilson didn't have a good year last year. He missed three games because of the injury, and when he came back too soon, he had pretty bad, uh, I pretty bad finish. I remember what uh, Yoda saw that he's talking about. When the Vikings missed that field goal and we won, remember? Oh, the Blair Walsh kick. Yeah. Yeah, that was kind of like that, except this one actually hit the upright. And then we hired him, right? Mm-hmm. In 2017. And then we missed the playoffs because of him. Oh, buddy. Missing too many field goals at the wrong possible time. Yoda Soto, who do you like more, the Rams or the Niners? I don't really like either of them. Right now, of course, it's the Niners who are the threat, so I guess I dislike the Niners more right now. The best thing that could happen tomorrow would be looking at the schedule ahead. Who is the Brent Niners playing? I think they play the Saints. Let me verify that. Okay, tomorrow the game's Buccaneers at the Browns, so we want the Browns to take the Buccaneers down. Bengals-Titans, doesn't really matter. 
Yeah, Broncos are at the Panthers. We'd like the Panthers to beat the Broncos. The Chargers play the Cardinals, so we want the Chargers to win. Rams, oh, the Rams are at the Chiefs. The Chiefs should beat the Rams. And then the Saints are at the 49ers, so that's, that's the one. We'd love to see the Saints beat the Niners at home to give them a loss. And if we can win, All that right. Oh, it looks I still... Oh, that was last year. Oh, that, that was, was last, last year? year. I wonder how many uh, cell phones dropped in this video. Yeah, they were talking about. They're showing a clip. That's where they they put the they put the flag out in the middle of the Husky Stadium fifty yard line and they went on celebration. So it. this is that trying to get payback and put their mark on. Wazoo's Field. Good game, but an eight-point lead. Missed a chance to make it a two-score game with 14.30 left. A lot of time left, really, in this game. Yep, a lot of time. And the way they, both teams are playing, you never can tell. That's, you know... Yoda says, is Huskies going to win? Trust me. Paul, well, I uh, guess if they get a touchdown, they go for the two-pointer. Yep. Throw a complete to the left side. Close to the marker. It's going to be it short by about a yard. yard. To go. Second and one. Ooh, he's limping a little bit, number 89. Oh, actually, second and two. Go ahead. Turnover would be nice sometime in this... Flea Flicker tosses it back to the quarterback. He rolls right. He's going to just run and don't hit him. He didn't he's going to be it. short. No, he's short. Well, wait, short by, he I don't know why he didn't stick his arm out. Why I know. He, he should have done that. That's the thing that wasn't, Wilson's been good at. You know, when he gets close, he yeah. just sticks it out and gets that extra thing. But he had the yeah, ball. Yeah, he didn't. Well, he couldn't do it there because he had a defender coming at him on that angle. If he sticks the ball out, it's potentially, it's potentially the guy could knock it out. That's probably why I didn't. So third one, big play right here if they can get the stop. High snap, hand it off. I got it. Just barely got it. Writh writhing and bending and just got enough for the first down. It's third and inches. That's so kind of hard down. because he's still limping. Yeah, he looks like he's kind of limping a little bit. Double tight ends with two receivers on the left, one on the right. Actually, one tight end on the right side. Takes a snap. He's play action. He's going to throw. Zips it to the left side. Complete for a first down. Forward progress should give it. Wait. Did he mark it short? Ooh. It should have been ahead. Forward it looked progress. looked like he didn't get that. I know. It looked like. Oh, that's yeah, first no, down, I guess. He didn't get it. <laughs> To their own 46 yard line. So with this drive, they could, if they score a touchdown, they could tie it with a two point conversion. 13 minutes left in the game. Snap. He's going to throw. He's got plenty of time. Everybody's rolling on the ground. Throws deep. Oh no, interference at the seven yard line. Do they put the ball at the spot of the foul? Because that's what happened to UW, but then they, put, they didn't put the ball until it was further away. Oh, it's a 15 yard penalty. So they don't do spot of the foul in college. It's not like the pros. He didn't turn around. Yeah, he never turned around. That's a good call. So it's a 15 yard penalty. I kind of like that, actually. I, I, I might actually could see that being a better ruling, even in the pros. Because, you know, in the pros, they put it wherever the foul mm -hmm. hits. So if you make, like, a 60-yard play and it happens like that, yeah, they, they get it right they, there. Here it's 15 they just, yards. Uh, they add 15 yards for the line of scrimmage. Line. It's more, I don't know, depending on how you look at it. Maybe more fair throws, middle of the field, overthrown. Oh, overthrown. Second and 10. We need to get turnover. We haven't had a turnover here at all. That was overthrown. We've had two on our side. 
Man, two turnovers and extra point missed, keeping the wazoo in on this. The over-under in this game was like 50. <laughs> they were only expecting, I think, something around 50, like expecting the either team to get about 25 points. Mm -hmm. That was way off. Second and 10. Snap. Another play action. He's going to run. Hit him. What? Take him down. Had him behind the line of scrimmage. Broke tackles. They got three. Third down and seven. Twelve and a half minutes left. He still can. Cannot be brought down easily. TikTok for kids. I do do TikTok, but I don't do it. I don't do it live. Here we go. Big play right here. Third here we down go. Eight. 39 yards. Snap. They rush four. Actually, they blitz. The pocket collapsing. They got him. Woo! Loss of seven. That's going to knock him out of field goal range. So now you got to decide. Go for it on fourth and 15. That is uh, what? It's fourth too long for a field goal and too long of a down a distance to go for it, I think. Oh, they had yeah. five guys, I think five or six guys rushing, and that was finally contained. You he he, he couldn't go punt? outside. They got a kick. Oh, yeah, he's got to punt. That was huge. That, if, I mean, they could have gone lot. for the field goal. Kick. He's going to try to pin him in. Let's it go. Oh, it's going to go in. Nope, they got the one-yard line. Uh, Ooh. Uh, That's been a couple of good punt plays here. Yep. Good kicking where they got the ball pinned inside the five yard line. See, the Huskies did it once and the Cougars did it too. Well, 11-11 yes, left in the game. If the Huskies can score here, it's going to increase the odds of a Huskies win here since they're up by eight at the moment. That was a big stop though right there. You think Washington can still go to the championship? I don't think so. Everybody's saying that. Andrew Puff says, "I, I want." I don't know, at least according to what I heard on the breakdown on the on TV, they kept saying that if we lose or if we win, that would make a three-way tie between Oregon, us, yeah. and Utah, and then Utah would go in because they they would have the tiebreaker. I don't know why. I don't know what the... Let's see if I can look at this and see. <laughs> see, Utah is 9-3. Oregon's 9-3. And, and if... See, but if the Huskies win, we'd be 10-2. and two. So I don't understand why would it be a... Why would it be a t oh because in the conference we'd be tied? We're six and two in the conference, because so we, we would all be seven and two, and somehow the tie would go to Utah because because we have a better overall record. We'd be ten and two, but that was that's that why because then. Utah beat Huskies. We didn't play no, but we didn't play. Yeah, Utah. they did. No, we only lost to. We lost to UCLA and Oregon. Okay, okay. Uh, I, I Arizona read something State. just now. So I don't, I don't know what the tiebreakers are. We would have a better overall record. We'd be tied to the conference record. So I don't know where it goes from there. I don't get it. USC finishes eight one, so they would be the first, and Utah would be next for whatever reason. Hmm. Yep, I don't really get it. See, it says Utah beat us. Beat AZ. Beat Ari oh, oh beat Utah beat. Wait. Arizona? But we lost to Arizona State, I thought. Oh, CFP does. You asked before. That's college yeah. football playoffs. Like the. Top the, the, like the nationwide one. The one that's oh, hard to get into and they have to see. vote on you getting in. But we needed to have not lost one of those games. So we needed to be we needed to be, you know, one loss only. It's hard. 
Like, you pretty much almost have to play perfectly. All right, here we go. UW swings it to McMillan. He's going to throw back again. Oh, wait, wait. Same play? No, this is the earlier play. Oh, that's the old. That's good. They run it again? <laughs> <laughs> it's insane. Exactly they're doing a play. recap. Exactly I was going, they're doing it again. <laughs> That's a replay, right? Yeah, it just replays. I was like, wait a second. This looks awfully familiar. Uh-huh. Yeah, Yoda said that was awesome when, uh, oh, when oh, the Huskies yeah, got to play at the one at the three yard line. He gets about a yard, maybe. All right, this is where the game's going to pick up speed now. 11 minutes left. The clock's going to really start yeah, to tick. Time. At the fourth quarter, time really goes too fast. <clears throat> yeah. Get a safety, Chase. Yeah, we went and played Alabama in the championship, and unfortunately just kind of kept it close in the first half, and then I think we ended on with like a pick six or something to end the first half, and then we were just like out of it the last, the last half. All right, Penix got to be careful here. <clears throat> they rush four. They're going to play action. He's going to throw. Swings it. Jeez. Wow. Pope came down with it, but like... short of the stick. So it's going to be third and one. Boy, he got that covered yeah. tight. He still got it in there. As soon as he caught it. I mean, the guy was right on him. Coming up on 10 minutes left in the game. UW up by eight, 41-33. Turnover in the end zone was brutal. Here we go. Third and one. Crucial down right here for both teams. If they get the first down, they can eat, off, eat up some clock. Hand off. Get there. Get there. Yes! Sneaks yep, in up the down. middle for a Huskies. First, first down. down. That was big. That's going to chew up a little bit more time off the clock here. Nine minutes. That's like two more minutes. Now they should take their time and let that play clock just keep going down to two seconds before and they you snap know the it. Play, the play clock, clock goes faster <laughs> at the fourth quarter. Right. Why is that? Well, they intentionally run plays that most likely won't, uh, you Eat know, some time, but huh? they, you know they're like less likely incomplete or not go out of bounds. So, but you got to snap it. Eight seconds left on the play clock. Inside of nine minutes left in the game. Five, Five four, three, two. Snap. Come on, go. Snap. Hand off right side. Go. Turn the corner. He does. 15, 20, 25, 30. First down. 35. Stay in bounds, bro. But he got the first down. Man, 40 yard line now. That was huge. I wish he'd, wish he'd slid down and didn't go out of bounds. But boy, what a nice bit of blocking downfield. Two guys down there leading the way. Oh. That was a steep yeah, it's past the 35 yard line. First and 10. First. Now the clock runs. All right, I did the first down. First down. Eight and a half minutes left with the first and 10 at the UW 39 yard line. Snap. He's going to throw. Rolls left. Penix going to pump fake throws. Com- incomplete. Ooh, that's not good. Clock stops. Incomplete. 8.20 left with the well, clock stopped. Not me. He's Second and 10. Time. Fans don't want to wake up at 4 a.m. to watch games on Mondays, too. Here we go. Second and 10, 8.20 left in the game. Snap. Penix to throw. Looking, looking. Screen screen pass. 40, 45. Navigating close to a first down. He might be a bit short, depending where they mark it. it. He's going to be really close. Nope, look. A yard. They're going to put a yard short. Good play. A little yeah. little it's screen on the outside. They go quick. Huddle, they go quick huddle here. Eight minutes left. Third and one. Another crucial third down. If they get this first down. Yes, he does. Breaks a tackle. He needed one. And he got three for another. Huskies. First, first down. down. Boy, that's huge. Another Is that Tali chunk Papa? of clock. Yeah, I think so. 7.45 left in the game. That's going to be... Get, they should be able to... Drain off at least another two minutes of clock here, depending on what happens in the next couple plays. They're going to want to try to keep this clock rolling. Penix to throw. Make it complete. Catches the football, Whoa, falling it, down. I thought it was it picked. Is, <laughs> the guy tried to, but the that tight end. Pick six. 
zipped it in ahead of the defender. Yeah, six just, yard gain yeah. right there. Wow. Mm. So six yard gain, man. That was a little close. Second and six, a four yard gain coming up on seven minutes. There's your two guys giving the signals. <laughs> what are the signals? <laughs> One guy's just making up something, and one guy's got the real play, I guess. Seven minutes left, second and six. Ball at the Hus- uh, Wazoo 45-yard line. Three receivers on the left. One tight end on the right, and a running back in the backfield. Waits till the f- final second. Four, three, He'll two. He'll it now. One. Snap it now. Stop. He's going to throw. Looking. Swings it. Oh, oh my God. Oh, wow. I was almost intercepted. Whoa. Oh my goodness. I thought he got it. I thought he got it. Third and six. Problem is the clock stops again. Ooh, another crucial third down. The way are they in a hurry? Well, they're not. That's why they're waiting to the last second to snap the ball. He snapped it with like one second left on the play clock. But now this time they can take whatever time because now they'll look at the other thing, get the signals. 14. Yep. 11. Very important play right here. Got to be careful. First down would be a huge play right here. Here we go. He's going to throw. Clean pocket. Throws. He's wide open. 40. 35. First down. Out. Don't stay mouse. 32 yard line, but he's out of bounds and he's got the first down. Another Husky. First down. Boy, that's huge. They've gotten every third down completion. You got to remember this drive started at their own three yard line. He was wide open. Nobody was. Oh God, nobody was guarding. So six seventeen left in the game. Clock continues to run. So oh, screen, bubble screen to the left. He's got room. First down, 20, 15, 10. He's down to the three yard line and out of bounds. Uh, Another Husky. First down. Uh, Boy, they are just clutch right now. I think Every that's it. play. The score here is going to be hard. It's not over, but it's a lot closer to being done. Is that Morsi? Yeah. Uh, Odunze. Is, is that Odunze? Odunze Man, he was like is. the player of the game. Here we game. go. Running play. Ooh, stonewalled at the three. No gain. Yeah, but. Second and goal. What's this? The quarterback's going to fake Oh, this. he might do the old uh, he was, option he was again. F- free in that then. He was, he was wide open on that one. Five and a half minutes left, second and goal. If they, if they score here, it's over. Uh, I wouldn't go that far, but it's definitely a lot closer to it being a possibility. Snap. Penix rolls to the right. He's going to throw out of bounds. He, McMillan wanted a flag, but he didn't get it. Third and goal. They got to get the touchdown, though. They have to get a touchdown. Now they're up by eight still. So three. I don't know any why he score. didn't run that thing. He said, oh, mm-hmm. "What happened?" There? Yeah, geez, there was some contact. I know. I would run the football. Well, now they will. Th- well, the other. They're either going to run it, uh, they're either going to throw it, or it might be a quarterback draw because it's an empty backfield. Three receivers on the right. Now motion, running back to the middle, to the left now. Snap. He's going to throw. Get rid of it. Out of bounds. So it's going to be a field goal. Ah, So they got to get the field goal just to get the points and go up by two. What? Oh, there's a flag. It's going to be interference or holding or something. I hope it's not against the Huskies. Ah, yeah, no! So they'll decline it. They'll push it back 10 yards and we'll have to kick it a little bit further. So 507 left. Washington will send their kicker out, who, remember, missed, missed. a super easy extra point just a little bit ago. We'll try to take <laughs> a 11 point lead. Well, that's, not, that's not too bad. Are they gonna go for it? No, oh, they're no. no, they're gonna kick it. This is basically an extra point. It's the same down, same distance. So, yeah. from the left hash this time. Last last time he missed it from the right hash. Peyton Henry. Snap, hold, kick is up, and this time, kick is good. <laughs> Sometimes on that angle, you can't tell. It looks like I think he got it. 
<laughs> so they go up by 11, 44 so, 33. Uh, that's down and. And they'll have to get the ball back. And Dude, that's down. Fi- no, no. It's 11, so it's a touchdown and a field goal. And a two-point conversion. Yeah. So they got to get sort of three things have to fall That's into place here with five minutes left in the game. So, but they, you know they've gone pretty fast down the field. So yeah, it's not over. It's not over. That's it. That makes it even you more. You guys think it's over? It's what not do they over say yet. now? Let's go. It's only two scores. They can go down and kick the field goal first, kick. and then do an onside. What or does that mean? Kick cat's tail. Kick the cat. Well, cats are the cougars. So. Oh. Everybody's assuming we've won, but you guys are being way too overconfident right now. Now, granted, the way the, the UW Huskies' offense is going, they're looking pretty tough to stop, but Wazoo's, yeah, they're quick strike, you know, so we'll see. Megan's like me. I'm still a little too uh, concerned. Obviously, it's nice to be up two scores. I don't remember what happened in 2012 Apple Cup. It says in there, play yeah, like yeah. it's 2012 Apple Cup. That's what X525 Crossfire says. I don't remember what happened so that in must that have Apple been Cup. a good Apple Cup win. That was 10 years ago? Mm-hmm. Let's see. How are we doing on the sub count? Could we possibly get to 120? Nope, still at 115. I'm happy we got uh, to 100. And two inside. and no sugar ball, rose ball. What a shame. Are you talking about for this? I thought there was still a chance the Huskies could play in the Rose Bowl. At least at one point I thought I heard that. But I don't know. I don't know how this whole system works. Yeah. They're going to play at some bowl. Hopefully it's a good, a good bowl. That's kind of interesting. How are they going to... How they determine all of those? Yoda Soda said, Norby going to hit 51K tomorrow. Uh, well, we'll see. I'd have to get 870 <laughs> something. That's a lot. That's a lot in one day. <laughs> but that's good things have happened. But usually the Seahawks games are usually pretty good. But we'll see how it goes. Mm-hmm. Oh, USC is going to the Rose Bowl. Oh, oh it? man. USC. Because oh. they won. I guess if they'd lost, maybe it would have been a different story. But. So we're not going to go to any bowl? Well, no, we'll get a bowl, but, but not there's as, so many bowls now. It used to be, as, uh, before, Ellingham. there used to be, bowls were kind of a very special thing. You know, the sugar bowl, the rose bowl, oh. the orange bowl, oh. peach bowl, peach bowl, cotton bowl. Now they got all kinds of Chick-fil-A bowl and all these spots. I don't even know what, <laughs> I don't even know what, what half these bowls even mean. Yeah, someday we'll maybe be back in that playoff thing. We had that one shot a few years ago when uh, they made it to the national championship, lost to yeah, Alabama. Yeah, that's true. Too many balls. Here we go. Boom. Here's okay, the kick. kick with right 5 0 2 left. And, oh. He's going to take it out from the goal line to the 10, 15, 20, 25, to the, down at the 27 yard line. Pretty decent return. First down, under five minutes left for Wazoo. They got to score at least one. Type of score on this drive. It doesn't have to be a touchdown. It could be a field goal, and then they'll have to get the ball back and then score a touchdown. So time is really the enemy for Wazoo right now. 11-point game. They'll need a touchdown, a two-point conversion, and a field goal to tie this game up. Here we go. Three receivers to the left, one to the right. Ward takes the shotgun snap. He's going to throw. Quick throw to the left side. Boom! Hit immediately after a gain of about six. It'll be third down and f- or second and four. They line up quickly, as they've been doing all game long. Four minutes and 42 seconds left in the contest. They should just go right away. Eric, thanks for subscribing. Hail Mary. Snap. He's going to throw. Three-man rush. He's Pressure! Oh. No, he gets away. Throws it near side. No. Incomplete no, 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 no. at the 40-yard line. Threw it low, and he couldn't, uh, I think it's Watson, couldn't handle it. So it's a third down and four. They had pressure. They had a three-man rush, and he almost I thought, got him. I thought they right got him. There. Right there. But you got to get more than just one a pair of arms around the guy because he's too strong and too elusive for that. But it, it messed up the throwing uh 
the throwing motion by the by the quarterback because of the pressures. So third down and four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Snap. He's going to run it. Hit him. Boom. Take oh, it man. down. Strange call there to go for a run. So now it's fourth and two. I kind of think this is probably four down territory. They'll have to go again and try to get a first down. If they don't get this first down, they're in trouble. Timeout, flag, something. Maybe they false Delay. start. I think it's a false start. I think somebody moved too quick. That's that's kind of a big deal. Fourth and seven instead of fourth and two. They can't, they can't you know, say, nope. No, you don't. And what? Oh, sure. Delay. Uh, it was on us. Delay a game on us because they said that we caused, we tried to draw them off, off their account. Uh -huh. Maddie Jack, thanks for subscribing. Wow. What the heck? So it's a, whatever it is, it's an automatic first down for, uh, for Wazoo from their 40 yard line. He's going to throw. Throws to the right side, complete first down to the 45, down at the 43 of UW. And that's another first down. Boy, that was a huge penalty. Snap. Looking, 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 looking. Pressure. Balls out. He got it back. Oh, he picked it up, but still, yeah, he got that's back. a crucial sack. Loses about seven or eight yards, and the he clock continues back. to run. 325 and counting, second down and long. Yeah, he got the ball out here. Whoop, right there. I can't believe we didn't get that. How did he get that ball back? Got lucky. That would have been the end of the game right there. <laughs> second and 19, a nine-yard loss. Ray Rush four. He's going to throw it under pressure again. Uh, rolls to the right. Looking, looking, looking. Throws it away. Third and 19. Boy, this is bad news for Wazoo. They got to get a big chunk of it right here. You should go now with the um, Hail Mary. <laughs> yeah, well, you got two shots at it, so you know you're going to go for a fourth down. You want to make it at least like fourth and less than 10 to give you a decent shot. They haven't really thrown that many deep balls today. Most of it's been shorter variety. He had one. Here we go. Third and 19 from their own 47-yard line, 48-yard line. Yep. Two receivers to the right, one to the left. Snap. He drops back. He's going to swing it to the running back. This is not going to work. Loses a yard. Fourth down and 20. I don't understand that call. Why would you throw to him? That's not. That's no well, chance. Maybe it's just everybody was covered. That's yeah, but he threw to him so quick. He didn't even give the chance for the yeah. other players to to develop. So this is the game. Four to twenty with two forty one. Snap. He's gonna look. He's got to go deep. Pressure's coming. He rolls right and escapes. Looking, looking, looking. Stops to throw. Backs up. Throws oh, across oh, the field I dangerously. Did. Oh my God! He got it. Oh, oh. no! Tackle him! Holy oh, do at the 43-yard line. That's going to be well short of the that's first it. down. That's and it. the Huskies will get the ball with 225. I think, I think that's the nail in the coffin. I think it's over. Now, Wazoo will try to stop the clock and, you know, get the ball back using his timeouts. But that's going to leave less than two minutes left. And if they stop him, they'll punt, pin him back with only seconds left. So this now. game is pretty much done. That was a horrible series. Yeah, it was terrible. I don't understand the throw to the left. That was like... I don't they, know why he has been doing that. I know, because... And they ran the ball, too, on one of those plays for a two-yard oh, gain. Yeah. They were throwing downfield. But maybe it's something that the defense was doing. With three... You know, with three minutes to go, they should be throwing forward. X five two five crossfire must be a Wazoo fan. He said, "Here's he's here's been our problem all season. Cam Ward turns into a pumpkin in the second half. Uh, <laughs> so apparently he starts off great and then just yeah. can't finish the game. Well, luckily for us, Willie Taggart fired again. What does that mean? Who's?" Willie, Ta I don't know who Willie Taggart is. Who's Willie Taggart? Who's Willie Taggart? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, we're not very. Well. 
Oh, yo, says so, so, Norm, people are asking if I played football. Oh, I see. Oh, yeah. yeah, actually, I did. I played football through high school. Uh, oh, yeah. You was a good running position. back and wide receiver. My, my glory days were really my the uh, early youth football days when I was like one of the fastest guys on the team. Yep. And I scored a lot of touchdowns. I remember that. The sad part was... I, I remember a, you got you got I was the a video. Coach. You were a coach too, and I remember we you bought a video camera the year after yep. we won the championship, yep. and we never went back to the championship that, after that. So we never had any video of the years when we you really have, played. You have well. a video when we played in the kingdom. Yep, when yep. you had a touchdown. When I had the touchdown, the kingdom, and I have other games too, but. We never had quite as good of a season as that first one. So you got the you got the camera one year too late, <laughs> as it turns out. That would have been fun to be able to watch those games on video. But yeah, you were with the Tigers, the Talbot Hill Tigers. Yep. Let's see. Well, it's speaking of numbers here. Where does the sub numbers fit? Ooh, 123. All right, we got past 120. Thank you very much, you guys. Well, we'll see. Maybe tomorrow. I'd be happy if we get to like 50... 130. Um, well, during the game, I should get a good chunk. If I get to 50... 200, that would yeah, be great. Yeah, that would be good. 200. But close to 50, 500 would be great because you know, every, every single one counts. So... All right, here we go. First and 10, 225 left. Wazoo with all their timeouts left. So a, a first down pretty much ends the game. If not, eh, it'll still be kind of interesting, but time will start to run out. Here's a handoff up the middle. Breaks a tackle. Five yards, so it'll be second down. Wazoo, as expected, will call a timeout. Well, he's first. He's... Oh, this clock is way behind. Let me refresh this. Okay, look, you... So Utah will face USC if UW wins, as we discussed. Oregon really blew it. Oregon had control of their own destiny to be in that championship game, and they blew it today, losing to Oregon State. I, I still don't know why the tiebreaker goes to Utah, but it is what it is, I guess. Hey, why is this clock so... There you go. 219 left in the game. Second and five. Where are we at here? About midfield? About midfield at the 48-yard line. This is despite two turnovers, too. Running play is expected. Up the middle. That's a first down. It's still going. <laughs> That's it. Game over. Game over. Still two minutes. No, oh, but first down. They're going to use all the timeouts and it's going to be over. That first down was Oh, la papa. It's pretty wow. good. Wow. See, again, even when good you know blocking, it's coming, look at this tackle. Blocking. This tackle right there, and he throws him forward, and he gets actually more yardage. Yeah, his feet was still yeah, so they can starting just, even running back. Yeah, they don't even bother to call timeout. They know it's over. So yeah. they can just they take a knee. Call? Nah, they know it's over. This is checkmate. Oh, he's going to just kneel? No. Well, well they're not, why not? not in victory formation. I don't know why. They could just take a knee. I think he is. Snap. Hand off. Running back. Just big hole. First down. He's gone. He's gone. Uh-oh. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Boy, we thought you just going to take a knee. Forget the knee. Let's put the stake through the heart <laughs> with a touchdown. 40 <laughs> yard <laughs> run <laughs> to break 50 points in the Apple Cup. Look at this hole. Look at that hole. Gigantic. And nobody after that. Once he got past he the first he layer. For somebody. Oh. I thought for a second maybe he'll stop at the one yard line and just take a knee, but wow, why not score the points? Well, hopefully this the Raider game will be like that tomorrow, where they expect mm -hmm. it to be close and yeah. just some kind of runaway train game. Uh -huh. So with the extra points to come, it's going to make it 51-33, an 18-point lead. And that's it. This game is all but done. Woo! They should, they should let, unless, uh, well, if they get the ball back, they should let the uh, horde. Just take a couple snaps. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it doesn't even matter. What a game. Those are good linebackers. Hey, you never know. I mean, Wazoo might throw something 
into the hands of the defenders, and they might get a turnover here. We still haven't gotten a turnover yet, right? Yeah, they still got how many? Yeah, they, One minute? We're negative two in the turnover battle, and we, we still won this thing going away. My scoreboard's still way six, behind. 6-7, 6-4, 6-7, 6-4. 51-33. 6-7, 6-4. Six, 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 Unbelievable. What a dominating. It, it just kind of... It was so close for a long time, and just in the last five minutes is where it all fell apart for for Wazoo. Phoenix was never sacked overseas. No, he hasn't. You didn't get sacked? I don't think he was ever sacked. Yeah, I don't remember a sack. You're right. Well, that's cool. No championship game in their future, but hey... They get bragging rights for this game. Here's the kickoff. Will he take it back? He will. 50, the five yard line. Ten, fumble 15, this. What's this? Fumble. 20, boom. Broke two tackle. Well, one tackle, and he's down to the 23 yard line. 123 left. 18 point game. I know all the Wazoo friends of mine are going to be bummed out. See you later, Yoda Soda. You're out of here. Ruel. <laughs> I feel sorry for Ruvel. Lionel Gates explains, Pac-12 title game tiebreaker only counts the games within, inside the Pac-12. UW cannot win the tiebreaker because UW requires all three conditions to meet, but the third condition yep. already failed. Good night. All right, here he goes. Here's a throw. Now. Under pressure, rolls right, throws it, complete. Nope, incomplete. He dropped it. Incomplete pass, second and ten. Just, they should uh, let the second team play now. <laughs> Yeah, they, it's a high score they game. They scored more. Him. It's a draw play. Left. He'll be short oh, of the oh first down. God. Nine yard gain. You know that the record is 83. Left. Oh, they broke the they for broke total points in an Apple one. Cup? Was that total points in an Apple Cup? I mean, I mean joint. Yeah. Oh, oh no. Oh, escapes it. Goes out first down. down. Stays in play. Breaks the tackle to the 40. Up to the 47-yard line. 47 seconds left. Game is just about over. You know, you AD can, you is waving. I assume that's waving. You can get hurt here. The no, he's waving bye-bye. Watson what? should not play anymore. Let's just finish this if up. If I were the one. Yeah, they call a timeout. Why? Do they really think they have a chance here? <laughs> it's an exercise I mean, if I were the coach, I wouldn't let Watson play anymore because he could be injured. Or Ward, the quarterback, you mean? Mm -hmm. Oh, our, our, our oh, running the running back. back. He's already injured. Yes. Yeah, well, it's the last game, though, right? I mean, yeah. nothing else to play. Well, no, they got a bowl game. I guess they got a bowl game That's to play. That's right. They got a bowl game. So there's that. But there's a lot of guys who they, they'll, they won't even play One, in the bowl two, game because they want to save themselves for, the, uh, for, the, for their Four, NFL five, six, seven, eight. draft preparation. I don't know how the referee could count them. Could count Wazoo to throw. Go. Looking, Hail Mary. looking. Hail Mary, come on, he's go. He's going to run. Oh, he's got to oh. run. Get out of bounds, bro. Out of the 49-yard line of game of five. Thanks to a little strength for, the subs for subscribing. Fifty-one twenty-six. 26 39 seconds left in the game. Here we go from the 49 yard line. Come Snap. on, go. Go now. Under pressure. He goes go. down. Oh, that's a great way to end this thing. With 30 seconds left, he is sacked. I guess they'll call their final timeout. Why? I don't even know why they're wasting their time with this. Oh, this is it. 31 seconds for a, uh, who knows, whatever. Yeah. I don't down even to the know. 40 yard line. It's going to be third down and like. 20 or something. Who's calling the timeout? Wazoo. Prolonging the agony. No, I mean the coach is telling him. Oh, I see AD giving the thumbs up. Must be making good progress on his script there. Good for you, man.
Who was the other guy that's obviously in the, like, he's bed reading or something? Oh, that's, uh, he was, you're there earlier. Um, yeah, he was always there. Um, last name Nguyen, first name. He must shoot, have, obviously. Yes, uh, Here we go, final, second to last come play. Come on, throw. throws, throws, middle of the field, complete to midfield. It's going to be fourth down in about Time out. seven or eight. Ah, no more. 20 seconds left. The final seconds of the Apple Cup in 2022. Winding down. 15 seconds now. Snap. The last play for Wazoo. Under pressure. And he's going to go down. The penalty. That's the end. Penalty. It ends with the exclamation mark by the defense. Five. Four. four. Oh, it is a flag. I know. What? It was a face mask. Really? On the sack? Uh-huh. That's why I would say Penalty. Oh, really? It's gotta be. Face mask. I wonder if you dub's gonna storm the field. Oh, it was on Wazoo, Dad. It was on the, it must have been a hold. Oh, so there was something on Wazoo. So you up gets the ball, and then there was another penalty for unsportsmanlike or something. There's the apple cup being revealed from its case. It looks like an apple. It does right. have an apple on top of the cup. It is an apple cup. It was close. It's hard to believe. Who's gonna though, hold it? Oh, I'm sure they pass it around like a like a champagne bottle. Is that what it looked like before? Yeah. Always like that? <laughs> yeah. It's literally like an apple on top of the cup. Like a little trophy cup with a little apple on it. Okay, so, line up. Five seconds. I know. They're trying to, they're like, we need one more guy. All right, here we go. The final play of the game with five seconds left. Apple cup. About to be history. 51-33. Unless they actually try to run a play to score here, but it should just be a new Delay of game. What are they doing? Run the play. Delay of game. What the heck? <laughs> See? <laughs> what? Oh, wait. Now they reset the play clock? Oh, maybe. Reset. Oh, because there was a penalty. They have to mark the penalty yardage off. That's why. All right. Takes a knee. Final play. There it is. Official. The Huskies win the 2022 Apple Cup 51 to 33. And that is it. With it with its UW students <coughs> storm the field. Nobody yet. Last year did they lose? Oh yeah. UW got killed. Almost like this, maybe kind of a flip score from this. Maybe worse than this. And it's the first 10 win season since 2018. He has, he has the other coach first. What would happen if he all of a sudden <laughs> broke? <laughs> <laughs> the way he's holding, he's holding it. it by the cup. Yeah, that's like not, a. Not that's, the, that's what I was thinking. Don't hold it by the trophy. Yeah. Hold it by the base. Yeah, what is that? <laughs> that's why I was thinking. Like, what happened? What if it goes. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be terrible. Oh, that's it. All right, you guys. It's a late night. We got an early game tomorrow. Yeah, so, yeah. Um, thank you, Norm. Oh, and there he is. You're asking about Richard. Richard Nguyen. Yes, he's right there. Hey, Richard. Richard is uh, there as he always well, is. Well, Richard, thanks for watching, Richard. Good to see you, oh, Richard. Good to see you, man. Oh, there's Richard. Hi, right, Richard. I hope you're feeling better with the uh, win of the Husky. I don't know if you're a Husky or I'm sure a he's Cougar. A husky. I'm sure he's, he's a, husky. a Husky. Actually, I don't know, but... Yeah? And That's AD... Good. Oh, he's... Uh, he's got his... Oh, I can't uh, hear you. I can't hear the AD. Mm -hmm. Oh, there he is. All right, AD, what was the good news? You guys finished? Uh, you uh, finished more pages in your script? Is that the good news? Uh, still uh -oh. working on it. Actually. Still working on it. All right. Well, that was fun, you guys. Late night game, but uh, we're gonna hit it tomorrow. Probably get down the stadium about ten, yeah, around eleven o'clock, eleven fifteen. Yep. And then uh, join me for the live stream. 
Uh, one hey, uh, by about twelve forty-five. The game will kickoffs at one o five tomorrow. So we'll be hitting it tomorrow. Hopefully, get a get a get win over the Raiders. It's gonna be fun. What? Right. Oh, did you see? Hey, can you yep. see this? Uh, yeah, kind of. Can't really see the details. Kinda. Barely. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, I can okay. kind of see it. Good okay. luck to you. Smash cutting on action. Ooh. Yeah. If you, can, okay. if you can read this, there you go. Yep, I see it. Glass shatters on the bar. Okay. Need, okay. Well, your, Rob, thank you so much. You uh, oh, I got to remove okay. this. Right, I I saw your your you mentioning about the uh, the link, so I'm not sure when I can look at it, but I will uh, later point Wait, here. How are you talking about this? Uh, yeah, okay, oh, that, there you yeah, go. The, yeah, the collaboration thing. That's pretty cool. Okay, All right, but we got to go. We got to say good night here. Say good luck goodbye. with that. Hey. Everybody, see you. Good night. Take care. See you. Good time tomorrow. So oh, yeah, we'll you see you see at, the, uh, at, the, at the game tomorrow. You guys want to see me tomorrow. Oh, so I might get some of it. I might get some of it.